So maybe we need to make sure the stockings are filled with care. We need to make sure we have the special cranberry sauce, Te Sebi. I've been perfecting my special recipe all this time. There's so much I have to catch you up on in the holidays, Sebi. Merry Christmas, everyone. How y'all doing? I hope y'all having a wonderful start to the day. Hope you're all well. Uh, for one day only, uh, it really is only today, we are joining uh, Walter White and the cast of Breaking Bad slash Stardew Valley for a Christmas special. It's not fucking loaded. Hang on. <laughs> there, we there we go. There we go. How's it going, folks? Merry Christmas to y'all. Very early stream as well. Uh, it was always going to be an early boy stream. Stream times are just kind of weird because it's Christmas. But how are y'all doing, folks? It's a bit bright. Yeah, sorry. Sorry about the white light. <laughs> it's, there's just no backdrop for it. Let me, let me just mute that so it just doesn't come up again. Hang on, there we go. Yeah, there we go, there we go. We're fine. Professional streamer. I only see blue. Does the game look okay? Wait, is the game... Is there a problem with the game? Oh, Jesus. Wait, why... Why is it so saturated? <laughs> okay, there we go. Alright, wow, there was something wrong. Alright, so... <laughs> there we go. There we go. Uh, I don't know what was going on there. Merry Christmas, everyone. For one day only, we're back on the farm. Let's go. You're all very welcome to the stream. Welcome to the end of winter year three. It's been a while. It's been a while since we played Stardew. It's one day only. There's so much life I have to show you, Sebi. Things have been really good since we uh, took over the farm and increased production. I can cook a nice turkey dinner now, Sebi. It's not just drugs. Or methamphetamine. I ate too many bran muffins for breakfast. Merry Christmas to you too, Emmy. Oh, God. So, I, I'm trying to remember how much of this we showed. Um, here's the wine cellar. I don't know if this was even fully repaired last time um, I played the game on stream. Uh, it is winter, so uh, a lot of the crops are kind of just dead at the moment. Uh, Walter has employed help of the Junimos since we last saw him. He's got full automation on the farm. Uh, he's also got f access to full teleportation. Uh, he's no longer losing his horse, too, because he can fucking summon it. <laughs> Mint's never gonna go missing again. <laughs> We set up a full kind of tappery here uh, to get our kegs. Uh, speaking of, speaking of the kegs, there's one house, right? There's two houses. That's two full houses. That's not even everything. Um, production has really ramped up for Walter since we last saw him. Sebi, I've really taken cooking the blue to heart. Uh, this is all ancient fruit. <laughs> so, we- I finally perfected my purity, Sebi. It's 99.2%, just like we always wanted. Like, he's done it. Wal Walter is, like, literally living the dream. Let me- let me harvest some of these before we get back. Uh, to the town real quick. Beads, thank you for the 15 gift subs. Emily, thank you for the thousand bits as well. Thank you very much, gang. There's nothing better than drugs for Christmas. You know, Christmas is a kind of drug if you think about it. We live in a society, Sebi. Walter gets his fucking Joker arc. Oh, God. Let me, let me just harvest all this, uh, real quick. Uh, we're gonna need to refill the wine cellar in, uh, in just a mo. Sebi, we have acquired the blue. Like, we really have. I, I don't know how much of this I've shown off. Uh, I don't know how much of this we saw at the end of Stardew. I think this bit is brand new. I've been playing this a bit in my off time, as you might be able to tell. 
uh, Walter White's been putting in work, to say the least. Two bullets, thank you for the five gift subs. So, thank you for the ten gift subs, thank you very much. Uh, this is the last stream of the year, by the way. Uh, I, I, I'm officially on break after this, so very Merry Christmas to folks. I hope you've all enjoyed the year that has been 2022. Uh, for content. It's, it's been it's been pretty wild. It's been a lot of fun. Uh, the best of RT game for 2022 will be releasing later tonight as well. I, I was thinking about doing it as a YouTube premiere, but I actually have decided against it just because. Just because it is Christmas Day, and I know some folks aren't going to be able to watch that live anyway. I figure I'm just going to release it, but I'm going to show the start of it early on today's stream. So you're going to see it in advance of everyone else before it actually releases uh, at 6. It's three hours long. It's three hours long. And I was, think I was thinking about, like, maybe I premiere it, maybe I don't. The fact that I'm streaming and then that's coming out, I decided, you know what? We're just going to leave it. We're just not going to premiere it. Uh, we're just going to release it this way. And so I hope that's understandable. I know what I'm doing tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I, I thought we'd just release it. It's a three-hour special. I'm going to show you guys the intro before you wrap up today's stream. So you can watch, see it. You can see it early. Uh, it's one of the best bits of the, the, the video, if I do say so. Um, it's just pretty good. I'm excited to see what people think of it. There's a, there's a lot of footage, too, to, to put together for this. Everyone give Chloe, like, a massive congrats. I'm patting the back for it, honestly, because she put in a lot of work. This has been like an edit in progress the entire year. Basically, as we edit every video, Chloe takes a few clips that are put away specifically for the best of at the end of the year, and then we compile all that. So it's a long edit. Hope it love, thank you for the five gift subs. Uh, Drake, thank you for a thousand bits. Sevi, we need to steal the villagers' hearts. <laughs> what kind of fucking crossover is this? It's like, Sevi! I've joined the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> like, what? Are we just like the worlds colliding? Sebi, I've become the tarnished undead. Sebi, have you been to Spain? There's a motorbike Pokemon there, Sebi. <laughs> Walt has a palace. He probably does. He probably does. Yeah, let's pat all the animals. Uh, also, because so much time has elapsed, uh, there's a lot of shit in it. <laughs> there's a lot of shit that's just been collected. Um, we're gonna have a lot of money um, very soon. Um, possibly because I've also been harvesting wine. There's 1,000 ancient fruit wine. Uh, I need a bottle of that because it's Christmas. Uh, yeah, a meteor hit the farm as well. A it crash landed here. Uh, I I've kind of just kept it uh, for the time being. It's a bit annoying location-wise, I'll be honest, but I'm too lazy to work around it. We got very lucky it didn't collide with the barn. <laughs> it could have been really bad. Okay, it's Christmas Day. Pelican Town is here. Sebi! There's so much I have to fill you in on! I'm your secret Santa, Sebi! Merry Christmas! The fucking stars aligned for us to be able to line this up uh, for today's stream. I, 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 this was not planned. It, it just worked out really fucking well. <laughs> oh, so it's you! Ah, star fruit wine. Thanks. I don't think you understand the purity of this batch, Sebi. Oh, it's uh, I I can't remember who you are. I I I I don't think I've ever talked to you in this town. Hey, Walter White. I'm your secret gift giver this year. Here, open it. What do we get? A ruby. <laughs> uh, sure. It's not much, but I hope you like it. What kind of drug is this, Caroline? 
You made a different flavor of product. Random, thank you for the 20 gift subs. Thank you very much. Very Merry Christmas. Thanks to the hype train folks as well. You're all welcome to the stream. How's it going? Walter White, what are you hoping to find under the spirit tree? Uh, <laughs> I don't know what to say to Emmy. The like drugs. <laughs> She's gonna be concerned. She's gonna be concerned. I could use some new ass kicking boots, Emmy. I've done so well in this town with my business. <laughs> I see, that would be a great gift. Oh god, the whole town's here. It's fine art making candy canes. You've really got to search far and wide for the best ingredients. They aren't easy to come by these days. But don't worry, Gus, I'll keep you supplied. We'll keep the chain going. Merry Christmas, Hector. He's gonna start dinging jingle bells on his bell soon. Keep an eye out for him. Keep an eye out for him. I actually have to talk to like one like the, the backbone of the entire town is Robin. It's good to see you all. Like, hey, hi Walter White. You're welcome to join our family table if you need company. Sebi, why are you crying again? I'm just trying to have a delicious meal with your relatives. There's no need to be so constantly upset. By the way, Emmy asked me to have a baby again the other night. Why are you crying? <laughs> oh, Jesus. It's like fucking nostalgic. I miss the days where we taunt uh, poor Sebastian relentlessly and make him regret existing on this mortal plane. Oh, here's everyone's favorite. Hey, Clint. Oh, you've really put on the holiday weight this year. No, you haven't started eating? Oh, my mistake. It must have been last year. Well, see you later, bud. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Just an asshole to Clint. <laughs> oh, God. He deserves it. <laughs> okay, let's uh, buy a nice winter banner. Uh, you know, let's get let's get some windows. Yeah, these, these might be nice. Put them in our home. Get another tree of the winter star. Happy with those. Ah, oh, God. Clint, Clint deserves it. He is big centrist energy. Oh no. <laughs> Thank you to everyone who's given bits there as well. Thank you very much, Sky, Five, Strange, Harry. Thank you very much. Clint's probably complained that you can't wish people a Merry Christmas. It's like, I don't want to say Happy Holidays. Snap Clint in half. Josie, Merry Christmas to you. Hope you're well. Hope you're having a wonderful day. We should brick Clint. We, do, we didn't have the brick as a meme, uh, or like, like, tool in our inventory last time we played Stardew. That was, that was before um, I became a filthy weeaboo anime streamer. That was a different time. Oh god. Let's uh let's put the Christmas tree down. We'll just uh just pop it there. Uh it's good enough. Uh holy shit, I have so much inventory I need to clear space with. I probably should have like timed the wine a bit better. Cause now I gotta quickly harvest all of it. And we do not have much time. It's like... Sebi, I, I, I know I said you could take Christmas off, Sebi. I know I'm supposed to give holiday pay as a, a, a leave of absence as your employer, but... We're really short-handed, Sebi. I don't suppose after you've finished your pudding... You can let your old man Walt a hand on the farm. Oh shit, I've only got three hours. I haven't even said hi to my family yet. I haven't said hi to my family. I don't have time. I don't know where my son is. I haven't seen my child today. Gotta go as quick as we can. We're probably just gonna collapse in the wine cellar. That's okay. That's okay. Um, it's just, it's necessary for the business. I, I don't get to take time off like the rest of you, Sebi. 
Every day my industry requires more and more input. Look at that, you're not poor anymore. How much money did I have the last time we streamed this? I can't remember. Like, we, we might have had a few million. Uh, we didn't have all the pillars, I know that much. I was able to get all of those since the last time. 42069. Oh, wow! What an, in what an insightful internet comment. I bet there's nothing uh, sus about that number, am I right, gamers? Oh no, I just got pranked, did I? Oh gosh darn it. You guys trolled me again with another May May. I gotta I gotta wise enough to you guys zany antics. Why do I see only darkness? Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas. Uh, I, I gotta rush home before Walt, Walt collapses. Uh, come on, man. <laughs> Let's quickly race on back. I can harvest the rest of our- I said hi to my son tonight. That counts. I spent Christmas with him. I spent Christmas with my family. That's all I have to do. Ro uh, Royal, thank you for the 500 bids. Merry Christmas, Dan. Thank you for streaming today. Very happy to see the blue return. I I've missed Stardew. Oh god, I, I, I really love this game. Uh, is it someone's birthday? Oh, okay, no one's. Right, uh, I guess I can... I can just toss that in the bin. Um, what's like the worst thing I could give him? Oh, hang on. I think I know. Um, I think I left like a like a a crab cage out in the ocean. I think that's been sitting there for like the last um, year. I don't think I've checked on it. Uh, I might be able to get some soggy newspaper. Let me have a quick old look. Something that I, 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 I don't know the degree I did this last time on stream, but the farm is way more automated than it ever was. And like, 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 Walter's got it down to like a fine art now. Like, there's just so much industry. Like, all of here is growing out too. We have so much blue. More than anything else. Like, all the other, like the original blue, like the blueberries and shit. Um, they are all, uh, growing on the island now. There's like a little nostalgia garden that you would have seen when I ran past it last time. So, you know, we have some of that there. Very happy with how my farm has turned out. 100% purity, Sevy. Like, I honestly want to try and get the clock. Um, now, granted, it costs 10 million gold, right? But, uh, your old Uncle Walt has a little trick up his, uh, blue latent sleeve. Uh, let me, let me show you what I have got in mind. We need, we need, we need to get the spring, and then I do have a plan. It's gonna cost us a bit of time. It's gonna cost us a bit of time, but I think it's gonna be worth it. You go for perfection. I'm still not interested in perfection. I, I thought about it in my off time, and I, it, I just concluded it's not fun. <laughs> it's just torturous. Um, and like, there's no point in doing it. Like, uh, like, like, unless you really want to just like exhaust enjoying this game. That's, that's the only reason I could see to do it. It's just not for me. It's not for me. It would suck all joy from this game out of it for me. It'd be way too painful. Yeah, we, we have a shitload of eggs in here, too. I kind of need to make some dino, dino mayo before long. Uh, let me just pop a low lot away. Like, look how much extra blue there is. Just to be, uh, wind up. That's all the extra. There's some fermenting. This is the sell goods box. Look at the shitload of cranberries I got. Like, <laughs> there's over 5,000 cranberries in this box. I got so many. But here's, uh, here's what I've been working on for my special batch, Sebi. 
I have 600 ancient seats. And come spring 1st, I am simply going to plant it across all of these plots. And for an entire year, it's going to be automated blue. This is like this is the end game. We're gonna have so much. It's all been leading up to this. Blue Eternal. <laughs> yeah, let me uh let me see if I can replace the windows here. Get some uh get some nice nice change of scenery. There we go. Get a stick a Christmassy banner in there. Okay, pop these in the fridge like we always do. Old time's sake. What happened to your son? Uh, he's not growing up. I I don't know what's wrong with him. He, he refuses to get older. He's he's been a toddler for like the entire year. It doesn't make sense in like real world time, but I would have thought taught that you know he'd grow up more at this point. He just refuses to age. I don't know. Like, he, he's been stuck like this ever since he was born. They don't age. Do they not? He's training to be an anime protagonist. Oh, of course. Moment of silence um, for Ash Ketchum. You know, he, he's not survived 2022. He's it's actually canonically dead now. He actually lost him. Okay, uh, I, need to, I need to give Clint something really shit. Um, so I've got an idea. Let me just, uh, avail of my beach totem. Let me get a cheeky teleport in. Okay, um, yeah, there's a bit of soggy newspaper here. This, this should be the perfect gift. Uh, for Clunt. Sorry, uh, Clint. Clint, I do apologize. Uh, let me, let me, uh, go, go say hey to him. <laughs> Oh, hey, Clint, you're working on your birthday. Oh, he's not. Where is the fucker? Where is he? Yeah, let me, let me get Mint. I'm never losing my horse again. He's in the tavern. Oh, yeah, oh, God, it's time for, like, chat to shine. You know, like, your, your stalker agenda. Like, where you know, like, precisely every location every character is at at all times. So, wh 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 where, where is he now? Where is he now? He's not in the tavern. He's in the community house. Oh. There's, there's, uh, the asshole mayor again. We haven't seen him in a while. Talk to him later. He's in the walls. <laughs> the community center on Fridays. Oh god, he's all here by himself. <laughs> Clint, I just got the paper uh, for your birthday today. Nothing of note happened. Much like the day you were born. Anyway, I dropped it in the ocean while I was running over here. I thought you might like to preserve the occasion, you know. Have something. Um, to, you know, to look back on for your miserable existence. Happy birthday, Clint. I'll leave you to your party, you know. It's a bit too exciting for me to hang out with you. <laughs> Happy birthday. He's so ungrateful. There was a... <laughs> Oh, there was a crossword puzzle on that bit of soggy newspaper, Clint. You should really appreciate the lengths I'd go to to find you these goods. They don't even they don't even print this newspaper in this region, Clint. Do you know how far across the Pacific Ocean that had to cross? He's a Clint cell. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Clint cell. Oh no.
Jacqueline's having a bad time. Okay, an arrowhead. Uh, I can't. I think we can just sell that. Toss it in the box. Uh, I think all I need to do now is I just need to fast forward to spring first. Uh, let me show you guys my grand machination. We're gonna. Walter's gonna jump through time a little bit now. We're gonna see if we can get the clock. See, we're gonna actually have our most profitable day ever. Uh, in a month's time. It's time to rip Van Winkle this farm. Yeah, I, we, we would have played this game before we uh, fully developed the Rip Van Winkle's technique. That was like a, a slime rancher development. Coma arc. <laughs> Just sleep until spring. Good morning, Emmy. I'm sorry I've been in bed all week. Happy New Year, honey. Let's make this a special one. This is gonna be our most profitable year yet, Emmy. I just know it. Look at that. The farm. It's good to go. Evelyn sent us a cake. Okay, we gotta we gotta clean up. Gonna have to do this bit ourselves before we can get the Junimos in. It's another beautiful year, Sebi. He's, he's, he's accomplished a lot. Oh, my barrel broke. That's that kind of sucks. Walter got hit by a truck, Eric. Oh no. I don't like I don't remember that Eric in the show. <laughs> oh he, he pushed himself too hard when he threw the pizza on the roof. The nice thing is as well, replaying this, I hope you've all done your homework, right? Cause now you've no excuse not to understand all the breaking bad references. You've had time to actually watch the show now. If I fling a pizza on the roof, I want to see y'all laughing. Okay? You've had time- uh, the, the assignment is due now. It's giving you ample time. Dad, I can't afford streaming services. I'm blown in half by this new episode. Yo, y'all should have seen Better Call Saul at this point, too. You want the the extra credit in this class? You should understand all that. You, you better have seen that, like, you know, the not-so-good, like, uh, movie. After the main series of Breaking Bad. Uh, actually, no, you, you don't need to have seen that one. It, it, it's alright. It's not the best. It's not the best. Extra credit in what episode does Hank first appear in Better Call Saul? <laughs> it's like, okay, pop quiz time. Get all of this soil done. Look at all this. It's so easy now. I don't know if I had the Iridium hoe last time. I can't remember. I know it took a while for me to actually get it. In which episode is it revealed that Hank is a furry? <laughs> he really broke bad. What can I say? Iridium Ho is my stripper name. <laughs> oh no. God damn it, guys. Stop flexing, Dad. I've so much equipment since your last visit at the farm, Sebi. So much more powerful. 
You want me to see- you want to see me till the soil? You want to see me do it again? Breaking Bad Christmas special. I mean, we were- we were truly robbed of that episode of the show, you know, it would have added a lot. I wanted to see, like, Walter in a Santa suit. Um, but he's, like, still trying to cook meth on the side. Got, like, an elf operation or something. Uh, I'm not catching the train. No, nothing's changed there. It's not possible. It's just not possible. Some things never change. Dad, please. Sebi died five years ago. You need to move on. Walter's just lonely. I mean, Sebi's not here half the time we're talking to him. It's like, Sebi! Sebi, look how I just tilled the land! It's like, Emmy just comes out of the house like, Walt, like, there's- there's no one here. Like, you know, the series has been over for, like, several months now. No, no, he's, he's here, Emmy! He's here to witness all my brilliant machinations! Ask who the one who knocks is! Go on! Uh, I'm just not gonna bother, um, water in the first day of this. Because it will- it will take too long to do when we can just rip Van Winkle it. Okay, so this is gonna be the ultimate blue harvest. So, ancient- ancient seeds? Uh, they last all the way up until the end of fall. Um, so I don't need to- this is the only plant of the year I now need to do. Which just shows you how insane things have gotten on the farm. One point a year. This is the most manual labor we have to do. Fertilizer? I don't think I actually need fertilizer. No, because it gets turned into wine, ultimately. Actually, I might need it here, actually, thinking about it, because I'm not going to be able to turn all this into wine, am I? There's, there's, there's simply too much. Oh, the chickens are angry. I'll check on They might have ran out of hay again. Yeah, so I'm, I'm turning it into wine, so... Um, or at least the majority of it. I guess I could pop down fertilizer. I guess if it's gonna stay here the entire year, it might make sense to... I feel like there'll be less angry comments. Sir, have you ever seen a min-max farm? I, I, I think I have. I've seen some farms where they literally occupy every space and just make it rain every day. And that's how they plant their crops. I'll, like that, that seems like way too much. That seems like way too much effort. Because the clock is the only real endgame goal that you need. Like, w w once you get that, you're pretty much done. And that only costs 10 million. I think even with a farm set up like this, like, we're going to be able to accomplish that. The farm is amazing. Thank you. I've, like, I've, like, w properly worked hard on it. Like, it is, it is fully automated. With the Junimo huts now as well, they, those are definitely, like, a new addition since last time. I didn't get to see those in uh, in effect, because I believe it was like only at the very end of year two I got them. That was year four. Like, like there, there's a whole arc. There's been like a time skip. I haven't checked in with Walter and the gang in a while. Yeah, they they can just eat away at the grass here. God, it's such a mess. <laughs> it looks so awful right now. Yeah, just get get rid of all this. Let me let me make sure they've got some hay. I uh, I stockpiled on some earlier. There we go. Pop all that in. Okay, uh, I now need to skip a month of the game. <laughs> I need to skip a month because we need all this to grow. You missed a spot in the second field. It will look ugly tomorrow. Beware. 
Wait, where where is it? Oh no, why'd you have to tell me that? Where 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 is the spot? I don't see it. Dad, I'm gonna ruin this. Also, Dad spends a shit uh, shitload of time in the game and makes it the prettiest. It's always the way I play games, though, alright? Like, we start off by flailing wildly and breaking game mechanics until we reach a logical endgame progression where I've replaced God. Uh, it tends to be how most video games go when we play them on the channel. Like, look at Elden Ring. We did amazing. Look at Persona. Look at Stardew. Right there. I don't- I don't see it. We somehow play optimally despite intensely shitposting. It's there. I don't see it. Where is it? You guys are just fucking with me. <laughs> It's right there. Blind streamer. Joseph, thank you for the 1500 bits. Thank you very much. Glad you enjoy the content. Mer very Merry Christmas to you. I, I have, a, I have a, a fair few jades scattered as well. Uh, we have some radioactive bars that I was able to uh, get too. I don't even know what I'm really supposed to use these for. I don't actually have many crafting recipes for them. They kind of just exist. I've been too scared to go into the slime hut. Also, yeah, maybe, maybe maybe we brave it uh, for the for the sake for the stream today. Uh, put this cake away. I've not been inside the slime hut in some time, right? So if it's bad in there, uh, you know I'll be mad. It's it's been considerable time. It's like popped away down in like the the woods over here. Oh, good lord. <laughs> uh, how do I break the slime again? Let's just, uh, let's just clear it out a bit. We don't, we don't need this much. Okay, oh god, okay, the free. Hang on. Let's quickly grab it. Quickly grab it. There's a lot of slimes, too. I think one of them had a quest, but he's trying to murder me. Okay, that's enough slime. I lost half my life force. 1500 slime gathered. They breached. God, you gotta be really careful in there. You've alerted the horde. <laughs> yeah, it's it's get it's real ugly in there. You gotta you gotta be very careful. I don't I don't know where I even put the slime, I'll be honest with you. Forty eight petrified slime. Still have two prismatic shards after everything's like done as well. But I somehow got a lot of that. Got so lucky with the prismatic shards. We might do a run of the mines. Maybe I can get like enough materials together for it. I think my slingshot still has some ammo. Uh, but I think for now it's time to rip Van Winkle. Um, the entire month away. Is there anything of note this month? Is there anything of note that we should probably- Okay, we should probably catch our wife's birthday. Uh, that would- that would look kind of bad. We should probably say hi to her then. <laughs> okay, so we're sleeping until the 27th. There's the Egg Festival and the Flower Dance too. We ha we haven't got time. We're Rip Van Winkleen. Spreading weeds have caused damage to your farm. We'll we'll repair it. We'll <laughs> you know, uh, New Year, new me. I me. Why not? <laughs> Let me let me go to sleep for like the next month now. Yeah, the, the the weeds are really gonna eat away. I I should maybe make sure that the farm is safe. 
Yeah, we're get we're getting that prompt a lot. Hang on, I should I should check on the farm. God, the mailbox is just gonna be filling up as the week goes on. Uh, let me just make sure that all of the ancient fruit is growing. Seems to be okay. It might be on the island where it's causing. Oh no, it's here. Okay, I see it. They're, they're trying to escape containment. Oh, good lord. Yeah, like it's it's really. They're... Nature's destroying my footpath, Sebi. That's why I need to stop time itself next. It's our next, like, brilliant plan for Walter. Uh, I can stop to get the wine if we want along the way. I mean, we might as well. There's only so much of this we're going to be able to, like, stew at a time. Although it might just be even more efficient to just wait uh, for all the crops to come in. No, you know, I, I think I think we just stop for the wine. So it's on, it's the fifth now, so it takes a week. So we check back on the twelfth. We'll rip Van Winkle like a week at a time. I want to see if we can get the clock, so like Walter White can defy time itself. Random, thank you for the thousand bits. Merry Christmas, Mr. Rumble Tumble. Merry Christmas to you too. He missed one already. <laughs> okay, all right, you, you, you're lucky I actually missed one there. I was never gonna trust again. If it turned out you were gaslighting me again. Yo, go, going into the new year chat. I'm gonna stop taking your shit. That's my resolution as a streamer. <laughs> It's my turn to gaslight all of you. Oh god. How can I live, laugh, love in these conditions? <laughs> Do people still get like live, laugh, love stuff? Is that still a thing? Because I, I I thought that was like nuked into like like orbit uh, after like such a, like a violent reaction, like so many of us just like ooh, it's terrible. I, I I haven't actually seen like a live laugh love like thing in anyone's home. I haven't seen one in the wild. seen kids with the top. Oh, they should know better, too. They should know better. Uh, we're gonna gear up so that we can keep these gold ones so we can simply sell them straight. Eventually. And I'm gonna coordinate it so that I do all my uh, gathering just on the same day. So, just once a week, Walt wakes from his coma gather the wine, and then he goes back to bed. Also, the animals all this time are just still gonna be producing like a shitload of stuff. So just once a week. Gotta get all this. He's in his fugue state. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, the fugue state arc. Nice. Didn't think you'd get to see that one. The island, too. Yeah, I, I need to go to the island once a week as well for it. I just realized I didn't use the fertilizer in the end. It, it's fine. It's fine. We, uh, we're gonna make a shitload off of this anyway. If I play my cards right, I could probably get another, like, shed for the wine. It just might be too much effort to maintain, though, is the only thing. Like, you know, optimal gameplay in Stardew dictates that every single space in your farm is occupied by a shed of wine. 
Uh, but, like, I don't know if I necessarily want to do that. We already have, like, two barns producing our batch. But we do have the means to get more of it, especially with all, like, the oak resin taps. I got real set fed up of waiting for, like, the taps before and, like, making the wine. So that's why I just got so many, like, an orchard planted over there. You missed one in the greenhouse? It's fine. It's fine. I've... I've already gone to the shops. I'm not going again for a week. Walter's putting his feet up now. You missed your wife. <laughs> oh shit, we get we get gold fruit now too. Oh, that's going to be worth so much. Look at all of this. That's so all oh, we got so much. He never got the auto petter. Uh, no, I didn't. I, I, the auto petter was only available in the, um, in the cavern, I believe. Oh, I didn't mean to take those cranberries. It's, it's fine. It was only available in the dungeon, but I just never got lucky with the drop. Uh, maybe we keep an eye out for a very lucky day and then we try go. Could be an idea. I think it's the only way for me to get it. It would be nice to have the auto petter because it would automate the final, the final thing necessary for Walter to achieve his grand machinations. It would automate love. You know, he truly would be able to break bad then. Wouldn't have to spend time with anyone. Does the auto petter work on people? Can I just put one next to, like, my child? <laughs> so I don't have to greet him every morning. <laughs> I'm a terrible father. Auto parent. <laughs> that, that, that's the You know, like, saying hi to my wife and Daryl and child every morning is too much effort. You know, I, I need to automate the process. I don't have time. I gotta be out picking the blueberries. I got another child coming now, too. He's probably not also not going to grow up. RT, the best dad in the world. Hire Sevi as your babysitter? Uh, I mean, he's probably crying. No, he's, he's, got, he's got a busy schedule. No, I checked in on Sevi's agenda the other week. 8, 8 a.m., he wakes up. Uh, 9 a.m., cries into his pillow for several hours. 12 a.m., he gets a snack. Uh, 1 p.m., resumes crying on the fresh side of the pillow. Oh no. <laughs> Got a busy day. Very busy. He's just like me. <laughs> ah, Jesus. If I clear some of the weeds, I, I don't think this is gonna help at all for cleaning up the farm. I just didn't bother really with this area. I think it was meant to plant banana trees, but. I get, I got distracted. Yeah, we got more blue. Ah, oh, the apricots are in bloom. Neat. I think that, no, the, no, yeah, those are gold ones. Those are gold ones. That's cool. I haven't said hi to some of the animals. There's crispy bacon. Oh, and who can forget? Ah, ah. 
best character. God, it's been a while, my man. Comedy gold right there. Yo, now, 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 now that, like, you know, it's been a while since we did the series. Uh, I hope I hope people are starting to realize just, like, how funny that joke was back in the day. So much time has passed that it's, it's aged like a fine wine. And you, know, you really come to appreciate all the Jack moments. Jack spit-off show. It's so funny, I keel over laughing every time. It's so funny, I am physically in pain. Uh, okay, we need to we need to wait another week. See you all next Friday. <laughs> I don't know where that's happening. <laughs> the farm's gonna be like destroyed at some point, presumably. In a lot of danger. When is Emily's birthday? It's at the end of the month. <laughs> Walt's got the flu. He just needs to spend some time in bed. Now we rinse and repeat. He's having a lot of bad luck days. I'm gonna visit Tante Lara. I'm gonna help out the saloon. Have a nice day. I hope our social right. Oh no, it's starting to suffer because we're Rip Van Winkle. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> okay, we'll we'll make it up to Emmy soon. We'll make it up to her. It's because I haven't been spending time with my family every day. They're, they're starting to get upset. Empty our post. Tomorrow's the Egg Festival. I think I already missed the Egg Festival. <laughs> I think we have missed that event. <laughs> That's okay though. That's okay. Let me, let me get some of this back out of the way. Maybe this is what's causing the damage to the farm. Get the wines all ready. Get rid of that too. That's the fiber farm there. I gotta delete this one piece of it now. Because I mucked it up there. It's fine, no one knows. Uh, I need to harvest, I should harvest the blue first. So that I can use like the lesser blue. This is pretty much what Walter's life has become. How he spends his days. Oh no, they destroyed one of the rare scarecrows! Oh god damn it, that's actually really bad. Oh, we need to get that clock. I'm actually missing one now. Oh no, which one was that? That's disastrous. It's the alien! Oh, damn it. Yeah. I can't remember how I got that. What event was the alien? The gambling one. Oh, no. We're gonna have to go to the casino again. We're gonna have to go. Okay, let me we, let me go day by day. I can say hi to my family, but more importantly, look for a high luck day. We're gonna, we're gonna need it. Gorman, thank you for a thousand bits. Thank you very much. Christmas gambling, woo. <laughs> oh, God, Danishiro never rests. Like, it's only one day left of the year, so after all, why not? Why shouldn't I get a little gamble in? <laughs> this 
still time. So how's Archie's content this year? It's like, well, he keeps gambling, and he's, I believe he's an alcoholic now, too. It's like, what a year. Uh, just saw off the gold bar. That's fine. I'm so confused if you're doing the Walter White voice uh, or Shadow RT. I mean, there, 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 there's, like a, there's like a tell I like to give um, that should distinguish the two. Okay, see if you can spot it, all right? Savvy! Money! Now, if you listen closely, you might be able to tell that Walter calls out for Sebi, whereas Danishiro, um, you know, is thirsty for capitalism. Hope that clears it up. I hope that clears it up. Makes everything easier to understand. Uh, Detective David Diamond, thank you for the 2,500 bits. Thank you very much. Hope you're enjoying the content. Uh, wait, where am I putting this? In there. Look at all of this I have to sell. I, I have 2,000 ancient fruit wine. 2,000. I'm gonna have even more soon. I need to go to the island farm. Pick up some more there. It's the relationship that our wife is with her in a way who is dead in our universe. Oh no. Now we can do more advanced Breaking Bad references. Like, now if I say, like, magnets. Like, you know, you can all, like, have a hearty laugh. You know what that means now. You've all did your homework. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> magnets. <laughs> it sounds so stupid without the context, doesn't it? So what's Breaking Bad really about? It's like, haha, the funny meth man. I'm sorry? Doesn't sound great. Oh, but love, thank you for a thousand bits. Ah uh, yes, Christmas gamble, and my grandma used to give us scratch-off tickets to stocking stuffers. Our family does that as well. We have like a scratch ticket under our placemat for after Christmas dinner. That's like a household tradition. Uh, pro it probably explains a lot. God, Cliff, thank you for a thousand bits. Long time VOD Gabo. First time donator. Uh, thanks for all the years of entertainment. I've been watching this higher tower and it's only gotten better since. Oh, thank you very much. Good man here, a good old while. Thank you. Glad you enjoyed the content. Uh, I, had, I had a little bit of uh, Christmas gambling in the form of Pokemon cards this morning. My brother very kindly got me some. I got a shiny Jirachi in one of my packs, which is pretty cool. Uh, that was pretty neat. Got like a nice Rotom tin. He's not addicted, guys. He's lying. <laughs> uh, show the shiny Jirachi you want to see it. It's like, um, if you just look it up, it's like Radiant Jirachi, I think is the name of the card. Pretty cool. Did you get a Pikachu, son? <laughs> you get, did you get one of those Charizards? Yeah, let's uh, redo the wine. We're gearing up for a bumper harvest at the end of the month. Yeah, help me out, chat. Wait. 
when the the fruit first grows, it's just gonna actually have like fruit, isn't it? I don't, it'll just be planted with it after a month. Yeah, so come the end of the month, we're gonna do our big sell all day. We're gonna gather everything. Actually, maybe I let it go for maybe I let it go for a little bit longer. I kind of want to go for a while and just see how much money we can amass. It's just an entire year of nothing but making money. Let's see how wildly we can ramp this. Once the Junimos get going, it'll be insane. Go until fall. <laughs> I mean, we could. We could. We're going a week at a time, so it's not going to take as long. Just a bit of busy work more than anything. Just, um, gathering the, the fruit. Stock in the wine. I don't even- I, I could just even ignore, uh, the ones I have to manually harvest after I get the automation going. It might just be a bit better on time to do that. Relationship deterioration speed run. <laughs> can, can, can your wife divorce you in this game? I can't remember. <laughs> if I neglect Emily too much. Yes, she can. Okay, I, I gotta be careful. We, we don't we don't want to start reenacting Breaking Bad here or anything, you know? Like, we gotta, we gotta be careful. Oh, God, God forbid! <laughs> Supposed to be like Walter's farm fantasy. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna salvage our relationship with our wife. Uh, come her birthday. Also gonna gift her a precious stone. Oh, she's she's not home. Can't say hi to my son today. She's just not home. World record pays. Boy, thank you for a thousand bits. Thank you very much. Put all them away. She already left. No, she's she's not. Uh, I think she's working at the bar. All I had left was the drugs. That's all I need. <laughs> And let's go say hey to her. Should be here? Yeah, there she is. Emmy! I forgot to say hi to you this morning. Right now it's busy, so I'm just helping out for old time's sake. It's fun. Okay, R relationship is gradually being restored. Oh, Sammy! What's new? How's our relationship with Sebi? Ah, uh, it's actually not bad with Sebi. Not bad with Sebi. Sebi, would you like a cup of joe? Whole town is gathering. They're all going to the pub. Can you kill Clint? Sadly not. Free history, thanks for 200 bits. You went to your wife's bar, gave her a rock, and left. <laughs> Yeah, she she likes those rocks, okay? Look, like here's like the precious stone box I have to surprise her, right? Here's like a bunch of her favorite minerals. Don't tell my brother, because you know he'll run off with that box. Okay. Um let's go another week. Go okay, we're gonna Day by day, though. We're gonna, we're gonna ignore the egg festival. Day by day, the main thing I want to check is a day for is a day with good luck. And if we get good luck, then it's casino time. That's only a little extra luck. We need more luck than that. I think we're going to the 19th. Oh, 
I already know how to make hash browns. Okay, perfect, perfect. It's gambling day. And it's someone's birthday because it's giving me a cake. I don't know who they are. <laughs> I never told you this, but when you first moved here, I had a dream about you. I knew right then that our life paths would intertwine. And every day has been a blessing since Emmy. Now excuse me while I will revert back to my comus fugue state. Hello, child. <laughs> you need to talk to her more. I'm d I've got to... Look, it's tough being Walter White all day, right? It's tricky. A lot going on. Okay. We can just warp to the desert now, too. I don't need to wait for the bus. But I do, I do need to wait for the casino. Okay, uh, this, is, this is kind of embarrassing. But that's okay, because I can return home. And I can simply go when I'm ready. I don't have time to open that fence. We've streamlined everything. Modern technology. Modern wizardry. I'm just seeing those bok choy seeds. I think though these are just sold now. Uh via Pierre's shop. Like a puzzle table. A chat the rare seed. Favorite's hair considering the amount of coffee he drinks. I mean, actually no, probably one cup of coffee is probably, uh, one cup of coffee a day is probably bad for you, isn't it? What's like the limit you're supposed to have, like coffee a week? How much is too, is, is bad for you? I you don't know. 17. I mean, 17 cups of coffee a day is probably going to do some damage to, you know, your system. Three cups a day is optimal, apparently. Is it? Okay. I'm like a social drinker when it comes to coffee. Like, I'll only ever get it when I'm with someone. I never make it, like, when I'm just by myself. You never have too much. Drank 10 to 15 mugs of coffee when I was in construction. I mean, that'd be very tough work. Yeah, you probably just need, like, the energy to keep you, like, alert. Wait, do I have anything that increases luck? Hang on. Let me just, uh, avail my teleportation system. A little more. That's attack. Plus fireman. Do I have anything for luck? Spicy eel? Yeah. Yeah, I'll take it. Should do the job. Eat one of these. Imagine like just eating like a like you know special sushi or something before you go to Vegas. I was like, wow, he's winning on the sloths a lot more. That's right, the sushi did that. Doesn't make much sense. I already bought one of his statues as well. I, I don't think I need another one. Okay, give me, give me a thousand to start with. Gotta have, gotta have some starting capital. There you go, 10 grand spent. This is the file on Walter White. He's only recycled 11 times. <laughs> That's a depressing stat. Everything else he just throws into the bin. 
without a care in the world. Okay, you already know what's going on here. Hang on. It's been a while since we had it play. And now we gamble. If we get the parsnips, it means we win. It's the one we're most likely to get. I need to win big so that I can go to blackjack and then start bit betting more liberally. I still want to try and get one of like the major slots. I see RT took the Gamba sponsor. <laughs> you know, they said uh, gambling uh, was banned on Twitch, but uh, life finds a way. <laughs> We just resort to like gambling in like Stardew slots and like Luigi poker. Let me let me like change the stream category to just like you know like slots or something. Get like a new stream tile. It's like win big money. Gotta go all in. God, I would love to get three cherries. That'd be amazing. It likes to give you two. It likes to give you two a lot. It's such a tease. It's times 500. It's such a difference. I think the best I've ever gotten is I got all the milks once. I don't think we had more success than that. Derma versus RT. Gamble off. I, I mean, we, I, both, so both times I have gambled, actually, Derma was there. Uh, because I, I it's only ever gambled in Vegas, and it happens to be um, where myself, Jeremy, and Italics all meet up. Um, the man, the man wins big. The man actually like properly wins when we're on the slots. Uh, apart from like the Willy Wonka one, apart from the Willy Wonka story, like last time we were in Vegas, like I, th I think he won like 400 bucks or something. He actually did quite well for himself. <laughs> And he was just playing with some of the machines. The man is cracked at gambling. I did not have the same luck. We all know Germ is not real. I mean, you're not wrong. He does sort of materialize sometimes. It's weird meeting him in person. There's like a fog that's all over the ground. and You can't really see too clear. I didn't like, kind of like a whisper in your ear. You just hear a faint, Monka S. And then he's there, and you just have a lovely time with him. It's very strange, very surreal. What's it like if we meet Dan IRL? <laughs> what would it be like to meet me? It's like, hi, they used to call me the Drift King back in college. Do you want to gamble? You got any money? No, that sounds like I'm gonna rob you. <laughs> Have you got any money? <laughs> like, holy shit, man, just take my wallet, don't hurt me. <laughs> it sounds like I'm gonna mug you. Y'all think RT is real. This is a pre recorded Christmas broadcast. You know, all the, the editing special effects are going to start to play soon. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's, that's pretty good. That's, that's the most we ever won. Can we get the fish, though? Or can we get the cherries? You're a psychopath who gambles for money. But, I mean, that's what everyone does with gambling. They all... They, everyone gambles for money. What's... <laughs> Why you gamble it otherwise? So you admit it. Can't cash in. 
If I encounter Dad, I would simply let him be. It's like, don't disturb him. Don't make any sudden movements. God, I really want to win big on the slots. I really just, I just want to get the three stars for Christmas. I know I've gotten the milk twice now. I know I've gotten that twice, but I just want to win 25,000 coins instantly. Is that too much to ask for? I know I've gotten the milk literally three times in a row now, but I just want 25,000 coins. Just a, just a little more gambling, you know, I still got some change left. I'm getting close to the three stars. Oh, it's 250,000 coins. Sorry. Okay, that's how many I want. That's how many I want. Travelin, thank you for a thousand bits. Fun fact, it's possible to get three star- It is possible to get three star drops. I know because it happened once in my Switch playthrough. I have so many coins, I don't even know what to do with them. <laughs> how many prizes can you get for all that? Yeah. <laughs> like, how many alien scarecrows do you need? Odd watchers skip the five hours. <laughs> just a, just a few more rolls of the reel, you know. Uh, just a few more spins. I just gotta win big with the three cherries. Oh, that's a parsnip round. Is he okay? <laughs> like, no, no, he's just he's just like this, you know. Let let him have his Christmas. He's just he just gets excited. Oh, that's pretty good. That's the new highest. That's the new highest right there. That's so many coins. It's not enough. Can't rest until it's at least the triple cherry. Gabe's like, no, please, just walk away while. Yeah, thank you for the two thousand bits. Oh, thank you very much for the kind words. I hope you're having a very merry Christmas yourself. Hope you're keeping well. God, you've enjoyed the content as ever. Just a, just a few more spins. Okay, if I, w if I win big again, I'll walk away, okay? By which I mean it needs to be at least the fish. Not even said a gab this quit before they win big, it's true. But you gotta go all in. Oh, damn, you're just away from the jackpot. Just go to blackjack. Okay, one, one, one more quick win. Hang on. Just a, just a sliver more. Just a few more spins. Okay, all right. Hit me. Uh, if I if I hit again there, I will lose. Double or nothing. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me. Double or nothing. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me. Hit me. No. Hit me. Hit me!
Look at no, we're gonna win big. We're gonna. <laughs> Why is the blackjack so much harder? We're gonna win big. Just give us twenty one. Just, just a few more rounds. Just a few. <laughs> I can get it back. Stand. No, this is rigged. This is rigged. 19. It's fucking standoff. Oh god! Okay, stand. Okay. If he wins this somehow, it's rigged. Okay, double or nothing. Okay, well, I guess it was just the standoff. That's a Kalika, Jack. You can't beat it. You can't. God, Blackjack sucks. Blackjack sucks. Give me back my rare crow. 12,000 coins still. I mean. Let me get back to the slots. I've got a good feeling. People are- I love how people are now begging me to go back to the slot machine as well. Like, please. Please pick the other form of gambling. This one's not gonna work. If you're gonna waste your money, at least do it here. Uh, what game is over here? Oh, this is the hundred coin table, okay. Okay, that- that's enough gambling for now. Uh, instead... We're gonna see how far in the mines we can go. Um, keep that with us. Put those away. And then I have a shitload of stone I can take. Oh, no, I, I should have bought the jades. Hang on, what day did they sell the jades? What day did they sell the jades, chat? Sunday. Oh, okay, perfect. Not sell the jades, what day did I sell the stairs? That should give us a good head start. <laughs> and now we can simply use the stairs until the game give us, gives us the auto petter. Ever so kindly. I also have like insane weapons now too. Let me just uh, reorganize this a bit. Going. Little Christmas spelunkin. God damn, I gotta stop doing that. I'm really bad for that. Speed run any percent. Nice thing is, because I have the return wand now as well, um, for getting back home, it's pretty straightforward. I don't know why it always does that. Gotta be careful. 
Don't want to waste any of these. Straight down to the core. I think it's guaranteed to give you something for 100 floors? Auto petter. Not quite. Not quite. We have quite a few turbans. Probably missing some valuable loot as we do this, just because we're not exploring each individual floor. There might be, um, was it uranium? I think that's the one we have to keep an eye out for. That's the dinosaur floor. We don't, we don't need it. We already have all that. Areas over monsters. That's cute. Keep going down. Walter's gonna go into the memento's depths. Subby, I found the Shibuya underground. <laughs> Why is everyone... Uh, people keep trying to relate Walter White to Persona. I don't think it's gonna work. Don't think it fits. I'm sick of society and damn adults too. I can be a phantom thief. Let me let me steal your heart. I feel like Walter would be more of like a persona villain. The game wants me to give up. Only gonna go deeper. Must go further beyond. Let me just get my alerts back as well. Uh, Brad and Azira, thank you for the bits. Merry Christmas to you. How'd you get Satan so quick in Persona 5? Um, I'm just that good. What can I say? I honestly don't know. People are like in shock at like the, the YouTube comments. Uh, for the latest highlights. Like holy shit he's broken it so bad. Happens, it happens in most games we play. I don't know how. Start off like woefully incompetent and then we'll just get absolutely cracked as time goes on. Few exceptions though. There you go. Like cities and like sims and that we don't, just don't improve in general. The rough time. He's a god gamer. What can I say? I'm just, uh, too good at games. Oh, please give me the thing. Need the auto petter. Probably should have got that one. I think that was the radiation one. A little deeper. Oh, there was a hole. I'm so stupid. Well, let me just manually climb down these next few floors. Now I can I can make a few more. We keep these ones for ourselves just in case we need them. In case we hit a monster floor or something. Because now, we should probably start mining at this depth. There we go. Okay, we already got it, I'll just pick up all that. Probably start mining at this depth, uh, just because we're running low on means to get deeper quick. Oh, I can kill these guys permanently now too, can't I? I have the thing for that. So, I'm so equipped. 
go so smoothly now. Look at these guys, they just don't give me any trouble. Don't even know what I need this Iridium for, I'll be honest. For money. I mean, I might end up start selling Iridium for that, yeah. I don't know what else I'm gonna do with it. They launch our last Mega- I should have put it over there. Alright. Give us another bomb, please. Most of our money is gonna come from, um, the blue. When it's harvested. We're just doing a cheeky run in here just to see if we can find anything. God, I'm really badly hurt. Like a battery? Ever need coal too? Pop that. Oh, I see, I see stairs. There's so much iridium here, but like, I don't, I don't need it all, do I? Yeah, that's about to run out anyway, so we just up, get this. The bats are battery powered. Ah, ah. So that's a real knee slapper. That was gonna be uranium. What was that again? Dead. I'm gonna hit you in the head with a bat. <laughs> Bit harsh, but okay. Like, Merry Christmas to you too, as you threaten violence. Put on the blue hat. But Walter's already got his signature hat from the show. We already have it. You don't understand how iconic this apparel is, Twitch chat. I have a fashion brand to maintain now. If you want to break bad in the fashion scene, you can do it with my new line of products. Let's go in. I think I got a prismatic shard there somehow. Oh, no, it's just some. Like, they're, they're so commonplace, you know. Got one of those items again. Don't know what, what to, where to put it or what to do with it. Mine these out and hope for the best. Did it. I did it. When does the RT brand Fedora drop it? <laughs> uh, we are. We're, we're not producing that. Uh, that's not a thing that's happening. Sorry to let everyone down. Why? <laughs> Would any of you even want that? And no, no memeing, no memeing, right? You're not allowed meme. All saying yes, like literally everyone. I buy thousands of them. So much shite in here. <laughs> Pull off the clock. I would spend my life savings. Okay! Well, it's gonna... Uh, we're gonna... Gonna put that to the test then. 
It's literally gonna cost you everything you own. Like, you know, you, you know when like you input your credit card to like make a payment online? This will deplete the account the purchase is made on. It just empties it. Like this will cost your entire bank account. Put it to the test. You said you spend your life savings on it. Do it. Do it right now. Jokes on you. I don't have a bank account. Well, you can't buy it. You can't buy it. You'll have to live without the patented fedora. So many cat. I don't need. I I don't have space. We we don't need two cowboy hats. Only two cowboy hats. Oh no, my five dollars. Why? We're, we're literally running out of space. Something had to go. If I, if, no matter what I threw away, like you, people, people were just gonna be like, why? No. Like, I, I, I could just throw out, like, oh no, that single, like, topaz. Why did he do that? He hates us. Not Jimmy, I was so attached to him. I love that one. Unsubscribing. It doesn't matter what I do. I can't, I can't win. I can't win. <laughs> know your place. Just like a power fantasy for some people in chat. Hey, I've always wanted to bully a streamer. <laughs> There he is over with monsters, not if I have anything to say about it. Yeah, let's go a few more floors, because we're running out of time. Seed maker, that's not quite what we wanted. Take it though. Bit slow on the old reflexes. Why the diamond? No. My family love that diamond. Do this, Dan. Like every time. Every time. That's what it's gonna be like. Dan, he hates us. There it is. I I don't even need to have chat here anymore. I could just like, I could create like an AI like chat generator. And like just fill it with anticipations of what viewers would say watching my live stream. And I think it'd be pretty accurate. We're gonna get replaced. God, that's a lot of gold. Hang on. Oh, there's a hole there. Hang on. I, I know we're short on time, but... <laughs> Quickly, another seven levels. <laughs> I 
Like, no! He skipped my favorite level! 182! Damn it, I was excited for him to do that floor! Now you might be thinking, oh no, he's running out of time. And Daniel's gone into a mining frenzy and he's not going to make it back in time. The man's going to be in a little bit of a pickle. Unless he does something. I have the return scepter. Pickle avoid it. Oh, sorry, just one second, gang. There we go, let me just get rid of that. We all good? You banned the Bible on chat. <laughs> Hail Santa. Hail Santa. Merry Christmas, folks. Oh, I, I should talk to my wife. I keep forgetting. There we go. Yeah, we did pretty good there. Look at all this junk we got. So much useless shit. Put the cowboy hat in there, sure. We praise it a drift king. <laughs> All you need. Another mushroom. We still have the rice and. Wait, I, I didn't, is the potluck coming up again? No, potluck's not for a while. That's, that's next month. Hope we could poison the governor one more time. <laughs> like, uh, it's an annual tradition, you know? That he must suffer. All that away. Uh, those go in there. I think I gotta get some, like, regular tools back. Yeah. Coffee. And I got the rare crow. That was the whole point of yesterday. The farm is restored. No more being over. I, I, I'm... God, delete that meteor. I know it's probably like a priceless artifact, but it's, it's just so in the way. Get out of here. Get out of here. No, the meteor! That was my favorite meteor! It's gone. He hates us, he hates us! Mike the Meteor, no. My favorite character. <laughs> uh, I got I got to sleep until the 19th. We're grow we're growing the berries this season. That's our goal. We need to increase the crop. And I'm going to say hi to my wife each day so she doesn't leave me. <laughs> oh, so she's pregnant. Yeah, this, this this looks really bad for me. Well, honey. Another tyrant day on the farm. I'm going to call it there. This looks really bad for us. During the night, Emily came first. Okay, randomize the name. Sitsa, Nino, Bitsu, Chapo, Fella. <laughs> That's your child's name, Fella. <laughs> Why? Oh, there it is. It's inside it. 
God, fella. Little fella. Okay. I already know how to make plum pudding. Two beautiful children. Oh no, now I have to say hi to both of them. Fella's sleeping. <laughs> Little fella white. She's gonna be bullied so hard. Yes, she is. We've set her up for failure, unfortunately. <laughs> okay, those ones are growing a little sooner just because we watered some bits. Should be alright, though. We just wait for it all to come on in. Pick up the jades, because we're going to need more stairs eventually. Oh, one of these days. Who sends a potato in the mail, too? Who does that? A, a single potato as well. The Irish. I don't think we even do that, I'll be honest with you. That's just kind of weird. Oh, another, another tiring day on the farm. I think I'll, I think I'll turn in for the night. Uh, let me just fast forward a day. It's still it's still on twelve. It's alright, we haven't missed our wife's birthday yet. That's my main concern. As long as we can catch her birthday, uh she won't leave us. <laughs> Even though we've done nothing but but hibernate all month. Shout out, thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you very much. Hope you're having a very Merry Christmas yourself. Seasonal depression arc. <laughs> Sammy! There's not a lot of light in the day, Sammy. Just kinda gives me low energy, you know? Uh... Okay, I need to get. I need to get the ancient fruit. I need to go to the island and the greenhouse. There. Something there. Not to be mistaken with uh, rest of the year depression. <laughs> oh, this is what I was talking about. My walls are all breaking. Oh, no. This is why we need the clock. Actually, no, I don't think the clock will even save these ones because it's on the island. All oh, the walls crumbled. I don't think I have enough stone either to actually even repair those yet. Breaking wall. You need two clocks. I don't think you can put a clock on the island though. I don't think you can. Island, you gotta maintain a bit, cause I. Like, Believe me, if we could pop stuff on the island, uh, the Junimo huts would already be, like, automating all this. I think I definitely improved the sprinkler system since last time I streamed this on the island and that in particular. Don't think you guys saw all this. Now all Iridium. Clock works for the island as well? Oh, perfect. Okay, so I, I just won't bother repairing the wall until we get the clock. Which, you know, we're, we're absolutely gonna do on this live stream today in like the next two hours. Oh, Jesus. Uh, Akechi's firm bot. 
God, I hate that username. <gasps> Thank you for the 11,000 bits. Jesus Christ. How's it going? Good to see you. Merry Christmas, they say. Oh, f fucking hell. It's terrible. Yeah, but there's still time to play darts with a catchy, yeah? Not even in Persona today. Thank you very much. It's very generous of you. Merry Christmas to you. Gotta get some more over here. Dr. Metal, thank you for a thousand bits. Thank you so much, guys. Merry to you and Merry Christmas. I want to say you're one of my favorite streamers and your videos always make me laugh. Thank you for the amazing content this year. Thank you very much. It's still, it still is crazy to me just how much content there's actually been this year. Like, like... I was, I think I was showing this in like the Lego stream and just trying to put it all in perspective. If you check like the channel main page now, um, like all the new playlists are just lined up for like the year and like there's just so many. Can't wait for the best of uh, 2022 stream. Yes, I, 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 I'm not sure if I'm going to do it as a premiere or just release it. I'm tempted to just release it. Because I know it's Christmas Day. I know some folks have like kind of quite a bit on. Um, so so I, I know I'm also live streaming. So yeah, I, I don't want to like occupy everyone's Christmas if that makes sense. If I'm doing the premiere today as well as a live stream, I think I might just release it as a video just because of that. I think if I was like to release it New Year's, I would have still done the premiere. But like I'm gonna, sp I think I think I'll just release it as a video. I think I might. Just because it's a lot of time to ask. Otherwise. Oh, Jesus. Zero, thank you for the 10,000 bits as well. Jesus Christ, guys. Thank you so much. Very kind of you. Very Merry Christmas to you. Game is eerily quiet right now as well. It's like silence on the farm. Let me let me uh, get the old jukebox going. Hang on. There we go. Uh, HD Sugar, thank you for a thousand bits. Thank you very much. Get well soon. I'm sorry to hear that. Hope you're doing okay. Hope you still have a very Merry Christmas nonetheless. Good to have you here. Likewise to everyone. Will you make Saw when the Chocolatier game comes out? Probably. Probably. I mean, it's a logical progression, ain't it? I do want to play Hana Chocolatier when it comes out. I think that'll be fun. Looks like it's gonna be good. We got a lot of good ancient fruit. And wine it away. We gear up for the end of this month, and then we're gonna try sell it all. I'm gonna see how close to the clock we are. I'm gonna sell everything. Everything I possibly can. Desperate attempt to make money. Crash the economy again. I don't- I don't think you can in this game. I don't think there really is an economy. Apparently Pierre just buys whatever you give him. I don't think he's gonna be able to pedal off this much wine, no. Business might be in trouble. Which means I'll be the only one left! Town will have no choice but to buy by marked up prices. Oh my, did I? Yeah, I got that drum. It's so eerily quiet. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Let's hear ourselves think a while. Spooky. A 
I'm scared. Uh, Marine, thank you for the 500 bits. Uh, thank you very much. Hope you and your family are doing okay. Good to have you here, and I wish you a very Merry Christmas nonetheless. Or blue. Yeah, I, I don't think production was this insane last time we were streaming this game. Uh, definitely with all the ancient fruit. I did not have this volume of ancient fruit last time you saw this. But, you know, th this was the logical end point. This is always how it was gonna go. And it's just like, and the, there's gonna be like another thousand gold star fruit. We chuck another 300 bottles of wine in the box. Christmas, Matt. How's it going, Chloe? Good to see ya. Look, look how much there is! Some extra types of wine, too. Just leftovers. There's all the berries. There's the star fruit wine. That we, uh, stored away last time. I've only got, like, one of those done. It takes so long for these to... to cook down here. We do have more coming. So much product, yeah. Like, like Walter's gone all out. Walter's gone mad. Why the Iridium ones stored? Well, the Iridium ones are in here because I'm waiting to sell them. I'm going to sell all this in one day. We're going to get our bumper harvest soon. Um, when all of the blue comes in here and the Junimos collect it for us. At least that's the goal. I'm tempted to fast forward the entire year. <laughs> What if when I get the crop, I just skip a year and let it all grow? Go to end of fall. I think we do that. I think that's the goal for today's stream. Your wife's gonna leave you, but she won't though, because I'm gonna remember her birthday. So it's okay. And I'm gonna say hi to her every morning. Raven, thank you for the five gift subs. Spirits are very angry. Oh, it's someone's birthday? Oh, it's Shane's. Okay, hang on, let's go say hey to Shane. Got pizza for him. The statue is so handy. The fact that it gives you just the perfect present every time. I also, I think I have the key to all their homes now. I think I got this at some point. <laughs> no one is safe from me anymore. Happy birthday, Shaney. Continue producing the blue at livestock. And I'll buy. You work for me now. <laughs> it's creepy. It is a little bit. Yeah, I could just barge into anyone's home. Anyway, that's been an exhausting day. Time to go to bed again. Jesus. Whew. Some days are tougher than others. I'll check the TV each day, too, to see if I can get some of these Queen of Sauce recipes. Don't need to say hi to my children, just my wife. Should be okay. We'll get all them. Okay, day's done. Day's over. Hey Crow, how you doing? Merry Christmas to you. Okay, and th this is what we're doing for the next two months. <laughs> Say hi to my wife, collect the statues, poke her head out the door, all's well. Back to bed, we, cause we, we need the forward time. We need to get this clock. Have you got wine, Agent? I do. This is our- this is our morning routine now. Just 
poke our head out the door just to see if there's anything. Flower dances tomorrow, okay? I, I gotta go to that because um, it really upsets Clint. That's important. Get our coffee in. Good morning, child. Wine stewing? Wine stewing. I think it's in another two days. Um, the other wine is done. The battery, Pam. Okay, uh, the flower dance is just down here, isn't it? Oh, it's still being set up, right. I just gotta wait a mo. It's all good, I can say hi to my animal friends. Ruben hates me. Because I've neglected them too long. <laughs> it's all good. Pet the rest of them. Get some honey. Take a nap in the meanwhile, you know, it's just simply exhausting work. I'm supposed to have flowers planted here, but I've been so focused on blue product that I just completely neglected it. There's supposed to be flowers there to get like special kinds of honey. Oh, a worm! I, I, I was actually trying to miss it there. Trying to miss it there. Just to, just to mess with y'all. Accidentally got it. Dan, you've done a lot of shit this year, but the one thing I can't forgive you for is that pineapple on our pizza. <laughs> I like because it's the pineapple specifically you're upset with. Never mind, like, the bacon process. Just specifically, it's like, pineapple! Uh, Harry, thank you for the five gift subs there. Thank you very much. Raven, thank you for them earlier, too. Don't know if I caught those already. Thank you very much, gang. Wedge, thank you for 500 bits. Thanks very much, everyone. I can't believe you put pizza on a perfectly good pineapple. It's probably the greater crime. Considering the degree I butchered it. They still haven't picked up that garbage down there. I... There's no way to get over and get it. Alright, uh, do we want to get anything? Nice ceiling leaves. Ball flower. Buy a bunch of daffodils. Dandelions. I feel like I can use these for something. Some stuff. Hey, you tried the red jelly yet? Yes, dear? Ask Emily to be your dance partner. Of course I'll dance with you. Oh yeah, we're in there. Hang right, where's Clint? Hang on. Has anyone seen him? There he- Clint, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Start the dads. Okay, wait, wait, where is he? Oh no! Clint has no one to dance with. Oh, I'm so sorry. Let me, let me lovingly embrace my wife. By the way, she had a second baby a little while ago, Clint. That means we fucked. <laughs> so sorry. 
so sad. That was fun. Time to go home. More than once. <laughs> Clint is in shambles. It's not coming back from that. Not coming back. Never gonna sit here from him again. Clint fandom's dying. Uh, Gamer Man, thank you for the 100 bits. Oh, thank you very much for getting the hoodie. It's very kind of you. I hope you like it. Uh, I'm trying to find space for this flower. Flint has a fandom? Probably not. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. Put it, put it in there. I think I can do something fun with these flowers. Let me let me have a quick look. I have like a few of them. Put them there. Put them there. I kind of like that. Wait, wait, hang on. Oh yeah, that, that that's way better. Just an extra. Um. There, it's a cute block. Pretty farm. Thank you. I've I've worked really hard on it. Wow, four gold! That was so impressive. Thank you. Thank you. It's not what people said at the start of this series. <laughs> <laughs> but we worked hard. Gonna have so much money soon. Just wait. I, the, the harvest is next week. Harvest is coming up. Oh, we restored hearts with Emily too. She, she's not gonna leave us. Okay, uh, well, you know, it's been an exhausting day. Better, better cut turn in for the night, you know, uh, early night's rest. It's Pierre's birthday, though. I don't, I don't know if I want to be friends with Pierre, though. I don't know if I do. Let me see. Let's see how he's getting on. I can I can barge I can force an entry to his home. Um, no one can stop me ever since I acquired the key to the town. Like I I I know he's there, but I can just be like. I can just go back here if I want. Oh, I'm not good enough friends there. Okay, you can't open every door with that. I thought you could. Alright, you should go on. There you go, Pierre. It's tempted to, I'll be honest, I was tempted just to eat in front of his face. Why is there a church in his house? I don't know. Seems like a weird place to have it. I think the church would be like a separate film. He's got a cult. Like, basically. Oh, Gus is still wonderful. Baked fish. Weird looking chicken. Okay, I think I'm not gonna harvest the wine just yet because I wanna wait for the harvest of all harvests. 
uh, that it's gonna be on the 28th. They run like a small community events in their home. I mean, I get they do, but like it's also a community center. It's just weird for the church specifically, you know. To just be in his home. Got to say hi to my wife. Okay, it's actually Emily's birthday tomorrow. Let's see what the magic birthday gift machine conjures for me. Emerald. Wait, where is she? Where? Where'd she go? I was sleeping. Oh, is she outside the house? Okay. She's with her crystals, right. Oh, she's meditating, yeah. You remember my birthday? Thank you, this is great. Favorite spot for a morning meditation. Visualize the energy from this crystal garden flowing through my body. Does the Christmas tree help, Lemmy? I figured the baubles are like a kind of crystal. Okay, uh, well, my job for today is done, and you know, to be frank with you, it's been truly exhausting. Uh, let's turn in for the night. I already know how to cook all these recipes. Okay, is it time? Oh, it's almost. It's not quite there. It's not quite there. Okay, a few more days. God, why do you keep getting in my way? You know how important the business is to me. Why are you crying? <laughs> I don't think I've spent any time with my other child. Yeah, it's now summer. I hope you all enjoyed spring. <laughs> Got the hot pot. It's coming up. Oh, it's okay. It's it's happening. It's happening. Get one more day. No, we're going to bed early. I'm excited. This is going to be harvest day. Let me, let me start my cup of joe. You're gonna have a little extra luck today. Yoba bless you. Oh, it's gonna bless me, Emmy. Oh shit, like literally, oh, I missed one. I missed two. Emmy, it's a beautiful day on the farm. Fields of blue. The perfect purity has been acquired. Oh my god, there's so much. Sammy, you're gonna need like a convoy of RVs for this one. Okay. Today is Harvest Everything Day and Sell Everything Day. We're gonna see how close we can get to the clock. So, for the clock, we need 10 million. 10 million is the goal. We might not get there in one go. But the goal is to acquire as much as humanly possible. To accelerate us towards it. Uh, we're gonna sell everything. plan is to defy time itself. 
Walt never has to worry about anything. This is the empire he always dreamed of. The clock, yeah, the clock stops fences deteriorating and stops weeds spreading on the farm, which means I never have to worry about maintenance. It's like the final step for like automation. Well, I, outside of the auto petters, but like th those are just incredibly unlikely. <laughs> It's incredibly unlikely we'll ever get those. Okay, grab everything we can. I gotta go to the island and grab everything there too. Absolutely everything. We're gonna grab like even the other products here. Okay, I inventory's already filling. That's fine. We're just simply gonna start selling early. Gonna sell the the pure gold ones as our. E everything's gotta go today. Everything's in the box. Bumper Harvest Day. I feel like we need some kind of music. What would, what would be suitable for farming? Not Doom. <laughs> Not Doom for once. It's always Doom. You got what you wanted. <laughs> it's over. It's over. Oh no. <laughs> Sebi! I'm gonna break bad today! Get the RV! We gotta cook, Sammy. And it's a mighty batch we're brewing. You always said I was the one who knocks. Now I'm the one who fucking slaps. It's time to rip it. This is so loud. Oh fuck! Okay, there's been a casualty. I'm gonna have to replant that. It's actually quite bad. That will take a month of in-game time to regrow. Unfortunate, to say the least. Reset. No, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, we're just gonna go all in today. Let's see where we are financially. Why not? See how high we can get it. I'll uh, keep some batches brewing for later in regards to the wine, so we're not completely out of business. Keep grabbing everything. The economy is suffering again. The economy's not had a good run on our channel. The economy always seems to be in jeopardy.
<laughs> it's like really crossing over with the casual, relaxing fire music. Okay, all right, we gotta continue the cook. I can get ordinary berries from here. Grab some of them. Uh, this way, I can sell off the higher quality ones. The two sides of my brain. <laughs> Gotta sell all the artisan wine too. It's a busy day. This will be the most amount of profit we've ever, we're ever going to generate in a single day as well. I, I can't remember what the previous record was. Someone would have to check like the the, the highlights for it. It might have been like 1.4 million. It's 1.3 million. So 1.3 million is what we're trying to beat. Let me, let me, uh, let me take another cup of Joe, Sammy. Got work to do. Heaven is where the blue is. Oh, Gus said he could only supply me with one lab. I have two now. I have fields of mesh, Sebi. It's truly beyond Walter's wildest dreams at this point. Put on the Fraser theme. I, I can't actually do that anymore because copyright. Can't do that anymore. Don't have any of my Ross Geller sound effects either uh, for Christmas this year. Yeah, that's all, Stuart. Now, I need to take everything out of this box and sell it. A stack of coffee beans. You missed one. Everyone's <laughs> losing their minds. Okay, we're not nearly done. In it goes. Okay, it's all down the hatch. Next up is the animals, who have run out of hay again. I, I need to remember to feed them. Especially because I have a lot of uh, hay just sitting here. There, they'll be fed now. There's even more here. We're just gonna sell it all. Keep that ostrich egg. We'll, uh, we'll incubate him, uh, inc incubate him someday. Okay, pop it all in. Grab everything here. Got it, gotta keep it at least one rabbit foot. Actually, wait, we have quite a few rabbit foots. All right, I think we, think we should be okay. Keep one for good man. There we go. Okay, all in the box. There's hundreds of eggs here. Even more being collected from here. <laughs> R 
grip and feed. Don't mind, don't mind the... Don't mind the, uh, you know... Relax and Stardew Valley music that's uh, playing in the background. You know, continue to have a hyped up and intense time. Okay, the these trees shouldn't have grown the way. Hang on, let me just, uh... <laughs> it's so fucking jarring. Let me get this sapling as part of my, uh, rip and tear montage. Okay, exhaust it. Exhaust it. Empty. That one's got one more. Okay. So, next up, I need to take a batch of the ancient fruit wine. And we need to put this away for later in the year. I need to get all the wine out of here. Don't drink it. This is Iridium Ancient Wine. This is the, one of the most valuable trade goods in the entire game. This is like the finest purity. Literally can't get much better than this. Go, keep making the rounds. People are like, you missed one, you missed one! I'm st- I'm st- I'm, no, I'm not done. I'm not done. Okay, done, 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 done. Done along there. And then there's two more. Okay, the basement is primed to explode. We'll see you again <laughs> come year five. Okay, put all our tools away. Okay, everything in this box has to go. That's a thousand, that's a stack of 1,000 ancient wine at the end. Everything's gotta go. Okay, what do we not need here? There's like some weird bits that we could probably just get rid of. Don't eat coral. Wild bait. Get rid of it. We have some various foods. Baked fish. Nice moment of calm again. What, what are we gonna take out of the box today? Goodness me. What do you think we're gonna sell? 71 iridium bars? Yep. All of the gold. Yep, sure. 34 truffles. 204 oak resin. <laughs> All the ginger, the bat wings, duck feather. 40 refined quartz, why not? 116 quartz. I, I mean, I might, I might need that one. So all the muscles. What, what else are we gonna s sell today? Goodness me. Merry old adventure are we going to have this time? Chat and friends. A lot of blueberry seeds left over. See what I can toss in.
Pop it all in. Okay, uh, Emily? Uh, you said Emerald was your favorite one, yeah? We're gonna, we're gonna sell some of these off. We're gonna sell a few. We can keep, we keep the ruby, keep the frozen tears. Oh, we should probably sell the diamonds. There we go, the diamonds will be worth a lot. All of them? Okay, fuck it. Fuck it. Yeah, we're, go we're going all in. We're going all in. No, you're right. So all that. Cherry bombs, we actually use them. I don't think there's anything here. I, I mean, these ones don't make sense to even sell. Look at that 787, like, quality fertilizer I could have used. Sell the animals. I don't think I could sell the animals. I gotta keep the rice and I can I can sell the mushrooms. Fairy rose is actually unique, I think. I think we should keep that. Some of this we so, like food we actually use. Sell the farm. Pop it in. You've gotta sell the house. Emmy! Is there anything we don't need? We check the valuables box. The stuff in here, no, the, these are... Oh, we have even more prismatic shards. We, we really have too many of those. We really have too many. <laughs> Emmy! Emmy, what else can we part with? Emmy, do we really need two children? They've got the kidneys are worth a lot these days, Emmy. They only need one. I think we're done. I think that's everything. I think, I think everything's sold that like, can realistically be sold. This is just food. It's not going to actually sell for that much. This, these are mostly crafting materials. We already got rid of most of the bars. I I, th I think this is pretty good. I really have so many prismatic shirts. I could just sell four of them. <laughs> this, this is gonna really upset someone. <laughs> Someone's gonna lose their mind that I just did that. I mean, I have so many. I only need- I'm just keeping one for a keepsake. I have like seven more. Make Juno's prismatic if you put it on the hut. Well, like that. Yeah, we'll get, we'll get, we'll give each of the Juno. Merry Christmas, my Junimos. Right-click on the hut. That's what I'm doing. Is that not right? Gaslit again. That's correct. Okay, I'll, 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 I'll give him each a prismatic shard. Merry Christmas, Junimos. Merry Christmas. 
Well, uh, let's hit the hay. Wait, hang on, actually, hang on, did I pillage? I could pillage the mushroom, hang on. <laughs> There's a little more to sell, Sebi! That was most riveting. You didn't sell Grandpa's altar, Jesus Christ. Okay, that's a bit much. That's a bit much. Okay. Let's see what all of our hard work is amended to. The ultimate harvest. This this will be the most we have ever raised in a day. <laughs> wait, hang on, wait! I thought it was more! It broke the counter! Wait, what? Why is it so little? Why is it so little? Wait, how much actually is it? Hang on. Oh my god, it's 11 million. <laughs> Sammy! Sammy, I can buy the clock! <laughs> Get the RV, Sammy! Holy shit! I have a million to spare! I have a million to spare! <laughs> You did it, Walt. Well. You're forever in the Empire business. You've defied space already with your teleports, and now you're about to defy time. Sebi, where's your god now? <laughs> I mean, it's gotta go, like, here or something. That's like the most, like, it has to be somewhere quite central. It's either there, I'm trying to think where is another spot. Could go over there too. Could go there. What do we think of that spot, gang? I've defied time itself, Sebi. I still have one million. Sammy, I feel like getting another soon. <laughs> I've already bought everything. There's nothing left. Merry Christmas, everyone. Merry wow, what a, a crazy adventure it's been. Sammy, I've defeated time itself. Look at this. So the fa the farm will never decay. We've done it. Sebi, I'm a time lord now. <laughs> like, basically. I need to chop down that one so we can actually see the candles. The farm will never decay, and so will you. <laughs> Sammy, I've become immortal. <laughs> I've become an eldritch being. 
existence can no longer contain me, Sebi. My family is probably very concerned because I've just been screaming Sebi for like the last hour. Or like the last two, three hours. I don't think they know about the Breaking Bad routine, like, like the Stardew Valley series. They don't know most of the channel, it's kind of unknown to them. They're probably really wondering what's going on. Well, um, we bought the clock. I, t t we're just rich now. That's it. Um, we beat the game. <laughs> Money is meaningless. What do we do now? Hundred <laughs> percent completion. No, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing. The reason I'm not doing perfection is because you have to do like every tedious chore in the game. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. I'd rather just cheat and just unlock whatever that gives you. I might just see if there's a workshop mod for it and get it that way. <laughs> I literally don't care. You watch paint dry. Yeah, but like, there's a difference between watching paint dry for an hour and wasting like 400 hours of my life to like cook every like breakfast in Stardew Valley. There's a difference. Okay, Mr. Curry man. Curry didn't take too long in the end. Curry didn't take too long. This one's different. This one, this one will actually take forever. Uh, you know, Sebi, uh... Guess I'll, guess I'll just go to Vegas! I guess I gotta do something with my time, Sebi! Oh, I don't know what the luck stat is for today. It might be shit. <laughs> it might be really bad. Life is meaningless now. <laughs> Sammy, what do I Sammy, I've become a god! What do I what do I do now? <laughs> Sorry, I didn't expect to get this far. Power, power, thank you for the 200 bits. Vader, thank you for the 200 bits earlier. Thanks everyone's giving bits and sub and appreciate it as ever. Merry Christmas to you. You could fill the town with kegs. <laughs> like, at what point? At what point is that pile big enough, Walt? Like, at what point is that? Is it enough money? Fill the entire town. <laughs> with just kegs everywhere. Like, no, like, there's a limit. Like, you gotta cash out after a certain point, or you'll just be here forever. Until the counter breaks. I think, uh, uh, like, 99 million is the limit. <laughs> That's as far as you can go. Yeah, the casino music's still playing. Uh, well, let's, uh, finish up our farm. I guess. We gotta, we gotta do something one at a time. Uh, on this planet. Uh, I can I can build up the farm and it will never decay now, which is like a nice feeling. I never have to worry about like weeds or anything as well. I can just uh, actually perfect it. Entropy is dead. <laughs> Yeah, no, it, it is. Walter White's really done it this time. He, he, I, 
He broke bad. Credits roll. I could, I, could, I could ease up on some of the trees here, maybe. We, we seem to have a lot of them. <laughs> They're struggling to grow. I can't, I can't even see, like, the, the, the slime hut anymore. Let me, let me get rid of a layer of them. Get to take the day off. Nice and relaxing. How's it going? Walter did it. Blow them all up. No, we, we, we don't need them. Well, it's kind of without purpose now. <laughs> this is like the epilogue. He, he just did it. It's time to restart. Like, do it again. <laughs> I actually, never, I actually didn't think we would be able to get the clock. I didn't think we would have enough. I didn't think we'd massively overshoot it. Just uh, patch up the old farmstead. There we go. Pick up the old Joja membership. I, I really think I'm good though. I really think I'm good. <laughs> nice and relaxing. No, that's 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 too relaxing. That's better. I'm just gonna, uh, let me just perfect my farm. So I, I never have to, because I have the clock, no weeds will ever grow. Which means that like whatever way I set it up, um, the farm will just stay like that. Which is a pretty lovely feeling. Don't have to worry about anything like decaying. Like, congrats, you've beaten Stardew Valley. The only thing really left is like, do you want to grow other crops? You want even more finances? You missed the towel by the slime place? Let me go back and get it. We're gonna, we're gonna just take a day and just like spruce up the farm. Did I actually miss a tile by the slime place? I see a branch here. On the road leading up. Oh, I see it. Yep. Peaceful day. I can, uh, yeah, I can finally get all this clean been like a mess in this area. Pop down these extra trees. Oh god, this, this is where the damage was happening too. I don't need to worry about that anymore. Pop down those ones just so we can see the farm better. Welcome to interior design screen, man. Or exterior, even. You're all very welcome. To, to my chill ASMR Christmas special. How's it going, friends of the farm? Walter here.
having a chill day. Walter White ASMR. Let your worries sink away with these relaxing, soothing th tones. You can't stream Breaking Bad, can you? <laughs> it's just the next step, like, fuck it. I'm just gonna pop the show on. Just try and stop me, Netflix. RT streams Telltale's Breaking Bad. I don't think Telltale did Breaking Bad. I think we would all remember that. God, it's so hard to see back here. I think that's where that went. Get rid of these trees. Just want to clean it up. Looks nice. Can we throw a bomb at Clint one last time, Dad? It's like, please, Daniel, for Christmas! I'd so love to throw an explosive in the mean man's face. Like, okay, you've been good this year. Like, ah, go on, go on. Dear Santa, can you launch a nuke at Billy from next door? He's a dick. <laughs> What about, like, mean letters to Santa? Like, Dear Santa, My maths teacher gave me a lot of homework the other day. I don't want to take kindly to that, because it's supposed to be the holidays, and I don't like fractions. Like, can you make it so that she doesn't come back after the holidays? Thanks. Love, Billy. It's like Santa at, like, Hitman. <laughs> He's making a fucking hit list and checking it twice. Gotta find out who's naughty or nice. Makes the song a lot scarier. You better watch out. Like, no, seriously. You better watch out. The, it's the weird floor. Man, why, do I, why do I even have that one? Go. I know it's late. Don't worry. I'm just gonna nip to the island real quick. I gotta. I gotta work out where to build these new walls. Won't be long. It won't be long. I'm going as fast as I can. Okay. All right. All right. I'll let me let me fix this in the morning. George, no. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> he moved out of the way. I thought that was it. Why do you need walls on the island? Ah, it's just nice decoration, ain't it? 
It's Gah's birthday. I get along with Gah. I share a name in scheme. And now it's just a piece of land in the farm. We don't have to worry about harvesting crops anymore this year. The Junimos will take care of it. Our only job really is to restock the wine. <laughs> I'll be honest, I didn't think we'd get it right away. I thought we would have had to go to the end of the year to see how much funds we'd need for the clock. But like, now we're just kind of done. <laughs> I guess what we can do is we can just chill a while and play some Stardew anyway. Because it has been a while. It has been a while. And it'd just be nice to hang out a bit. We can just chill from here. I'll like tend to the wine. How y'all doing? Let me clean up this mess of trees. We're in the new Christmas jumper right now, it's very snug. I'm glad, thank you again for getting it. Goes to everyone who got the Christmas jumpers and that. I hope you all like them. Same with the hoodies. Thank you very much. I've got my own Christmas jumper I'll be wearing at family dinner. They're always a bit confused why it says I want die, but they've just grown to not question it. They've grown to not question it. It's one of those YouTube things. It's it's a funny joke. There's nothing in this cabin, by the way. I'm pretty sure this just exists. Yep, this is like for like multiplayer or something. I just felt like building a home. That would just be a nice spot for one. Look nice there. Oh, hang on. I should, uh... Reinforce the bottom of this. There we go. That looks nicer. And if I'm doing that... Build it out here. Go on, we'll just extend the path. Let me let me let me finally fix this. Getting around to, like doing our yard work now. <laughs> I should I should have cleaned this up years ago. It's got an auto pattern on level 39 to skull cavern. Nice. Popped in real quick just to say happy holidays, everyone. My cat loves you all. Oh bless. Happy holidays. Your better eye for design than I ever will. It's actually one of my favorite parts in a lot of games, is like just the like customization and interior design stuff. Like no joke, I I spent so many hours even in like Animal Crossing and shit, and I like just be design. It brings me a lot of joy. So you know, I like when I get to like add a little bit of decorative flair whenever we're playing a series. Because now it's like, hey, you know, like, this it doesn't look ugly as shit anymore. Oh, that's, that's always like a nice feeling. go this bit's all, this bit's just gonna be perpetually messy I think but I can clean it up a little clean up a little there we go walls erected I think that's good it's mainly just the pat the pat is like being ravaged I don't think it will be anymore. Does the clock really work on the island? Because that's great if it does. Of course I ain't it did. 
It does, yeah, that's fantastic. Happy days. Are you gonna play Placid Duck Sim again? <laughs> I, is, is there anything to play? <laughs> I do love it, but it is just me watching. I, d I did love streaming it, but like, there's not much going on, you know? There's not much, there's not much for me to say. It's a nice chill idle game. But like, I don't think it's something like I'm not gonna be able to actively stream, you know? Oh, welcome to like Placid Duck Sundays. The anti cook cookie clicker. It's a wonderful little game. It is wonderful. But I don't I don't think there's much point in me streaming again. I don't know what I could add that I haven't already done in that existing stream. <laughs> you know? That's how I like always go about content. Like if there's something new I can do that might be fun, I'm like, okay, let's do more of that. And if if there's not, then I've just I've had my fun and I move on. Wasn't that rare back in the day? I think it was. We don't need it anymore. It had DLC. I mean that's cool. That's cool. But I mean I'm I'm good for now, honestly. I'm good. I've had I've had my fun with that game. There's, like, there's no point in me just doing something again just because it's more of it. it. Has to be like a fun reason. Like for Star of You, I actually did want to just save it for Christmas, and I knew I spent a bit of time on my farm off stream. And uh, you know, it being Christmas, I just want to do something a bit fun and nostalgic. You know, a lot of times passed. I thought it'd be nice. Fest of return. I mean, we've got a lot of Persona in, but this is like one of the other really big series this year. I know how ever, much everyone loves the Stardew series. I miss the drug farm. When's the RT 2022? It's gonna release for six. Um, I'm probably not gonna do a premiere. I, th I think I've decided on that, and I think just the reason is the fact that I've already streamed today, like, you know, I. I know people might have to hop off and do some stuff. So I don't really see the point in kind of watching it live with everyone. If that's the case, you know, uh, I think we've already done pretty good today. Because if we, if I, if I debut it as a premiere, then it's like, basically, here's like eight hours of streaming on Christmas Day. Like, that, that's a heavy ask. That's a heavy ask. I want to just make sure there's some content for everyone, though. So it'll still go up. So you can still watch it. And you can just watch it whenever it suits. I'm still going to show you guys the intro for that before we wrap up today's stream. Because I think it's fun. Uh, and I do hope everyone enjoys the best of. It's going to be the last video this year. It's a compilation of everything over the course of the year. Um, I just hope everyone, like, properly enjoys it. And, like, you know, it's something you can kind of go back and watch. Uh, how long is it? It's three hours. It's three hours, Eclipse. And uh, it, it's weird looking at it this year, because, like, normally it's, like, because we always do the clips in, like, order of the videos and, like, release times. Uh, this year, because of the way we did series, where we're, like, we kind of marathon the games at a time, you, there's very clearly, like, chunks of the video. Like, there's, like, a Pokemon chunk. There's, like, an Elden Ring chunk. There's even, like, if there's, like, two different Stardew chunks. Um, so it's quite funny in terms of highlights because there's basically like a bit of the video where you get that and this is like the 10 minute Pokemon block before we get to something else. Um, which is quite cool. It's quite cool, honestly. Close all these gates. This is, the animals are escaping. <laughs> Leave this one open so they can get home. Good, so I can skip Persona 5 to not spoil myself. The last one in it is Persona 5. So, uh, like, just to, when you get, you start getting towards the end. I mean, it's quite clearly telegraphed which video you're on, too. There's, like, little alerts that pop up. So it's very handy to watch. And, like, not spoil yourself on something. If you do decide, then I want to watch this video. You're the reason I started making drugs. <laughs> Uh-oh. 
That is so good. I'm in trouble. Where's the Xmas decoration on the farm? There's a Christmas tree. It's over there. We got a Christmas tree. You're an accomplice now, RT. I learned it from watching you, Dad. Oh no. <laughs> that fucking old commercial. I remember that one. It's very dramatic. Relationship with Emmy is restored. With our own child, it's going well. Uh, I don't think I've said hi to our other child. I've, I've completely ignored Leo on the island. <laughs> I've ignored a lot of these other characters. I've just never spoken to. That's all right. It's all right. Uh, we'll go fishing. Might as well. Would it eventually be highlights for today and yesterday's stream? Uh, I don't know. I'm not worrying about that, though. Uh, I'm on break. I am on break. So I'm just not going to worry about that till the new year. No idea. But like, come the new year, we might go back, we might look at some of the streams then. And then be like, hey, yeah, maybe this might make for a fun video. Don't know yet. But I'm not worrying about it for now. Because I want to just relax the next while. Take some time off. What are you going to do during, during your break? Uh, I am meeting up with friends for New Year's. Um, You might remember last year... Uh, that a gang of us, uh, like this, like the board game squad. I don't know what you call our gang, <laughs> but like Spiff, Kiwo, Kelly, uh, Ash, and Merrick. Uh, we all went to Scotland for New Year's. Uh, we're doing that again. Uh, we, we that, that's like our New Year's tradition we want to do now. Uh, so I'm gonna be flying out uh, next week, and I'm we're just gonna we're holding up. We bring in like Magic the Gathering cards and board games. And we are disconnecting from the world. And it's going to be lovely and wonderful. I cannot wait. It's going to be really chill. And I'll be back in Ireland in January. And I'm just going to take some downtime. Um, just some time off. Now, when I come back, though, right? This is, this is the big mention. Um, I think it's going to work out that it's going to be like two weeks from now. Uh, but, like, that weekend, whenever I get back from Scotland, I am going to quickly come back specifically to do Persona 5 and finish it. Because I don't want to leave that one too long, and it's on my brain, too, as much as it ever everyone else's. Like, 7 to 8 of January, I think it's something like that. Yeah, I think it's something like that. I'm going to come back, we're going to do Persona 5, we're going to finish it. I believe we have one arc left. And then I'm going to go back on break. And then you'll see me, like, probably about, like, two weeks after that. Mid-break for soda to get the addiction in, basically. Yeah. So I'll be, like, like after today, it's, like, two weeks. Come back for Persona. Probably, like, another two weeks then. Something like that. And we'll be back. Taking some proper downtime, because I'm, I'm bad at taking breaks, you know, I, I really am, like, I do love doing this, you know, and it's a lot of fun. It never feels like work for me, but, like, you know, you have to not exhaust yourself, too, because, like, burnout is very real. And the best way to stay that off, honestly, is just take the time you need. Pace yourself. You know, I, I think even in terms of content, like, it's always a good thing for me to do, because, like, if I take some time off, I'll get a bunch of new ideas, and then I'll, like, come back, and it's like, hey, I got, like, a load of new shit to show off. So I, I think it's, like, really good even from, like, a content perspective to do that. And take the downtime. Have a break, Dan. Have a Kit Kat. I'm a paid. I'm paid to say this. <laughs> oh, okay, how's it going?
Yeah, I'm just looking forward to it. Like, it's gonna be nice and relaxing, honestly. Gonna gonna actually try read some books too. I've been putting off. Uh, I've never read Dune. Like shockingly, uh, like, I got a copy of it because like I know Spiff really recommended it. And also, it's fucking Dune. Um, you know, so I actually just really want to take some time just to read that. Got some other ones too. Let me have you pulling the good in the magic packs. Thank you. I can't remember what it was. Like we got something insane. In like a pack a while back, like like like, like Kelly did because she was around. Like we were like opening some magic packs. It was like um, what you call it? It was like a black mana one, but it was like a promo set one. I want to say his name is Sheogora, but that's the obliv the Oblivion guy, so that's not right. <laughs> Sheodra, is that it? I don't know. Sheodred. Is it Sheoldred? The Phyrexian. Ah, oh, okay, right. I think we got we got one of those, but it was like on like because like magic is very kind to us sometimes. Just ever since we did like the magic sponsors between like the original one and like the robot wars. Uh, they're kind when they just like, whenever there's like new sets and shit, they're just like, hey, you want some carrots? It's like, sure. You know, it, it, they're not even asking for a sponsor or anything at that point. They're just like, hey, we know you like magic. Do you want some magic carrots? Um, so like, we, we got that in one of them. Yeah, so sorry, sorry about the Steam notification there. Apologies. Uh, the one I really like in Magic still is still the Painbow deck. That one's been really fun. That's just like the pre-built Commander one. Uh, because I, I suck at making the decks myself. <laughs> I'm really bad. Fucking Spiff and Ash, like, are like our friends who go like all out on Magic. Like, holy shit, like, they, they, like, they had one that we played, like, during the Jingle Jam. And, like, I, I was playing like one, like one of their decks, and it was basically like this land deck where you basically destroy all of your opponent's lands, but then regenerate your own with cards. Oh, I'm totally gonna pass out. Hang on, let me, let me just get close to the bed. Gah! Gah, tell your mother! Tell your mother to get me the rest of the way! <laughs> close enough. Um, but that, that, that deck was really fun. Uh, they they have some like really stupid crazy ones. They had one where like you get infected and you have like ten turns to live or something ridiculous like that. Like Lewis was playing that one. Jesus, that scared the shit out of me. And I'm like, Val, thank you very much. Ah. Uh. Merry Crumbus and festivities and snow and ice and frostbite and the unstoppable march of time leading to the universe uh, into a cold oblivion. Thank you very much, Val. It scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I don't know why. Yeah, here's some sushi in the post. Sh sure. Uh, you wanna just go fishing again? Yeah, we got we got we got a bit of bait to use. Help me, uh, help me out, Chad. Where should I be going fishing? Is there, like, a legendary fish or anything? It's, like, summer. You guys might know this better than me. Happy to just try. Fishing bad. That- That just fucking destroy- Fucker. Did that right in front of me. Beach, sewer, or mountain. Jesus Christ. I don't know why I'm on edge. I stay number one. Merry Christmas. Jesus Christ, Akechi. That's too much. Thank you so much. That's incredibly generous. Thank you very much and a very Merry Christmas to you.
I just need one of these to repair my path. The butt is very generous. <laughs> yes, it is. Okay, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll go to the sewer. We'll, we'll fish down there a while. But we're, we're just chilling and chatting a bit now. When are we playing darts with Akechi? Well, he's, he's alive again, apparently, so we might get the... <laughs> uh, so what, from what I understand as well, right, um, for the base game Persona, uh, the game ends when Sai tells you that, that, you know, you're gonna need to, like, confess to your crimes and go to court and shit. Like, the game is supposed to just end. And in the mark of the royal content specifically is when Akechi shows up. Oh, hey, I've never spoken to you. What's going on? It's Walter White, right? What do you want from me, small child? Just enjoying this great weather, Walter White. Hmm. Hey, go long. I don't have time for these trivial games, small child. Nice try. Gonna be the first professional grid ball player from Stardew Valley. No doubt in my mind. I already led my school's team to the regional playoffs. Now I'm just training and getting stronger so I can claim my spot in the roster. The Zuzu Siddle City, City Tunnelers. You just wait. Wow, you're really arrogant. <laughs> you know, in the spirit, in the spirit of Christmas, Alex. I'm gonna be kind to you. You gotta stop dreaming. <laughs> And wake up. Need to be a realist, Alex. I'm out of here. Well, this is awkward. Uh. I wasn't even trying to go here. Sorry, I was trying to go to the sewer. That's where I meant to go. Pop down here, let's do a little fishing. And we can just chill and chat a while longer. This is his own private domicile and he will not be harassed. So you did your homework! You saw Breaking Bad, I can tell! That's a Breaking Bad joke, gang. I can tell. He said the thing. Let's catch some lovely sewer fish. You're goddamn right. <laughs> ah, God. Favorite Christmas gift. Uh, I mean, well, with, with my family, um, so how my family does Christmas, we, we tend to, like, kind of write a little wish list for each person. Because it's just easier, and then we kind of just swap lists, and we're just like, oh, just pick a few items off that. We just kind of come up with a few things. Um, for me, in recent years, I I mean, I think that's only consistent of, like, just, if you're going to get me something, just, I wouldn't say no to Pokemon cards or Lego. <laughs> Basically. So, you know, I, I cannot complain. It's very kind of my parents and my brother. I owe extended family, too. It's just how we do things. It's just easier, honestly. Everyone I know gets fucking air fryers. <laughs> there was like an air fryer crusade, like uh, a few years back. Yeah, I remember that. Everyone got one. I think I got one. I mean, it's great. You know, I, I love my air fryer. Makes cooking easy. Oh, we want a bonsai tree, uh... Lego set. Oh, that, well, bonsai tree. Yeah, that's awesome. In the Lego mood at the moment. That's the one with the, the, the frogs. The, like, the pink ones. 
I just asked Verity game hoodies. That's very kind. I mean, thank you very much for supporting myself there, too. I appreciate it. Air fryer stream when? <laughs> Next year, D&D type video or live stream, even podcast would be really cool. Um, I, I know uh, Kiwo wants to do some D&D &D stuff. Now, that would be, like, on her channel, though. I guess. So, it wouldn't be myself doing anything there. I, I am not a good D&D &D host. I tried once when I was, like, I want to say, like, 16 or something, and I was kind of shit at it. Um, my friend Stuart's a good DM. And then Kiwo really wants to DM. But I, I, I don't know what the story is there when that's even happening, I'll be honest with you. Clearly you own an air fryer. Ah, oh, God. It's just hard to find the time for D&D &D more than anything. Like, that, that that's like the main limitation. Like, it's good fun when you play it. But holy shit, like, you gotta get everyone together for, like, a six-hour block, you know? And it's gotta be at least, like, a le like a long amount of time like that, because you get into it. You know, if you only play D&D &D for, like, two hours, it's kind of sad. Because, like, you get started, and then you gotta stop. You know, like, like, personally, I find that frustrating. Everyone's perpetually busy, too. Thank goodness for online D and D. Yeah, like roll twenty, and that makes it that definitely makes it easier. Has gotten a bit easier, but it's nice as well if you can do it in person. You know, it's like y'all just get to hang out, and like have a few drinks and that together too. Good time. I think these these are mostly regular fish, but no really insane one yet. Hope you like carp. Need fishing power of food. I'm good. I'm just casually fishing. I'm happy with what I'm doing. Uh, Sly, thank you for the uh, thank you for the kind words. Thank you very much. Glad you enjoyed the content. Yeah, thanks to everyone that has been sending the kind messages and that too. I, I really do hope everyone's enjoyed the videos this year. I, I've had so much fun just with all the games. Like, it re like there's just so much I always want to play and it's like this year we actually got to do a lot of it. Like Bloodborne I know is something like I have wanted to properly finish for years. I played some of it in 2020. But I never got right out into playing it completely like that. I think that was the one I was probably the most excited for going in. But Persona as well, of course. Persona as well. Stardew as well, of course. It's been nice just having the time. And it's just like, I'm just doing whatever this year. It's, it's been really liberating. Any games you never got around to this year? Yeah, no, there definitely is. Uh, but if you stay tuned, you might get to see them before long. Elden Ring remains forgotten. I said Elden Ring. Elden Ring is great. You either do this optimally or not at all, Dad. My brain will not accept it any other way. <laughs> it's, either, it's like 100% completion or it's like he just flails wildly for like three hours. Surprised how fast the Pokemon hype ended, sadly. I mean, the Pokemon was really fun, right? I think it's just the technical jank. It's really off-putting. Like, I, I, I finished I finished the Pokedex and stuff like that. I've loved it. I want to do more shiny hunts. But it's like, it's just a buggy mess of a game. <laughs> like, you know, it, it is it is very off-putting, sadly. I sunk a lot of time to Legends Arceus this year, even off-stream. Uh, Burn, thank you for the 10 gift subs. Thank you very much. If we live in hope that Pokemon gets patched, it'd be, it'd be nice. Will you ever play G-Force? I don't think people actually want me to play that. I think it's just a meme. <laughs> it's 
Like, if I go live with the stream that day, it's like, Okay, guys, it's finally the cult classic you've all been waiting for. G-Force. Half of you are going to be, what? What, what? what are you playing? The other half will be like, huh. And then there'll be like one guy is like, this isn't TF2. And it's like, you know, that, that's it. That's it. I don't know. I don't know if that's, um, I don't know if that's something that like, people actually want me to play. What was the worst stream of the year for you? The worst stream. Um... <laughs> would it be bad to say that yesterday's stream is a contender just purely because of the amount of scuff? <laughs> like, literally yesterday. <laughs> it might have been the worst stream of the year uh, just because there was so much going wrong. And it took so long to get started, and also people couldn't open the door in my house with the internet dropping. It was fun! It was really fun, don't get me wrong! But holy shit, it was so scuffed. <laughs> it feels terrible to say it was the worst stream yesterday. <laughs> it's so stupid. What about Mario Sunshine? Uh, Mario Sunshine was was pain and suffering. It was, but like we kind of got through that just because of like some of the jokes in chat. Bianco Bros carry that playthrough quite hard. I think if if I had to place it as one, like I would say probably the Quarry. I think that was like my because that was really disappointing. Like I was devastated playing that game because that was one I was genuinely so excited for, as a new release. You know? And that that was a really disappointing game. It just didn't live up to Until Dawn. It was like very mediocre. It's hard it's hard to label something as like the worst stream of the year. Honestly, just because like even if it's like the game itself is bad, it can it can still be entertaining to play it, you know? Like, I mean like the fucking metaverse was abysmal. But that was a very fun stream to do. It was still very fun. I had a great time. Heavy rain. Heavy rain was a train wreck, yeah. But we kind of laughed at tri heavy rain. The fucking Oblivion NPC dialogue. I love that. Hey dad, I would really hope next year you could do a watch and paint dry 2 stream. We've already done that. We've already done that under different guises at several points. It's just not highlight wordy. <laughs> We've already done that. We did watch grass grow. That's happened. You missed it. We've had painting streams too. We've literally had to sit and wa like watch paint dry. Like we we've done it. Placid, uh, Placid, yeah, the, the Duck Simulator game was like a contender for that kind of game, too. Lest we forget. Let's see who's in the pub. What about a miniature painting stream? I don't really paint miniatures anymore. I used to. I used to do a bit of Warhammer back in the day. It's not really for me, though. Watch Water Freeze. I don't want to just be, like, I don't want to just be as like, Ho! Oh, another zany live stream from RT Game. We do some trivial shit for, like, another four hours. Let's go. I don't, I don't want that to be all my content. <laughs> Guys, I'm going to watch my fingernails grow today. Like, oh, okay. Like, sure. Emmy! Just want to see you at work. My snuggle pie. But your audience does. <laughs> Watch milk curdle. 
Like, whoa, it's so zany. Watch my life spiral downhill. <laughs> oh, no. Would you ever try out Deltarune by any chance? Ah, uh, no. No, I do not want to. Uh, the fandom for Undertale was quite rough streaming that game. I, I still enjoyed it. Uh, I'm glad I got to play it uh, on, on my own terms. But no, I'm, I'm like Deltarune, Amori, Earthbound, Night in the Woods, um, One Shot. Like all of those games have been like hard vetoed forever. Uh, like anything with like a really intense fandom. Just because it's too much. It's too much. There's too much expectation as to what those games are going to be, I think. Because I, I, I don't think people want me to play that game. They want to see... They want to see me play that game and see if I had the same reaction they did. Which is very different. They don't want me to have fun with it. They want to make sure that I have the same reaction. Which is different. Would you play them offline? Probably not. There's just other games I want to play. There's always so many games I want to play. Like, I think I'm good. Hey, Clint, how you doing? Drinking for one again, huh? Depressing. <laughs> yeah, I mean, just looking at you. You're a sorry sight. Well, time to go back to my loving wife and two children. Sorry, just rubbing it in for Clint. Just rubbing it in. <laughs> Will you play Echoes of the Eye? I might do that one off stream. I might do that. Off stream. Any plans to play uh, Tears of the Kingdom when it comes out? Yeah, I really want to play that. Uh, I, I'm excited for it. It's basically Breath of the Wild 2. Uh, they've called it Tears of the Kingdom. They should have just called it Breath of the Wild 2, honestly. That's what it is. Like, uh, that's just what it is. I guess Zelda doesn't really do numbered sequels, but... That's how I'm referring to it. It's basically what it is. Yeah, th th there's a lot of games I want to play in the new year, though. I've got, I've got a working list. There's also a suggestion box on the Discord server. You're more than welcome to pop them in. It's the best way to keep track of them all. Uh, I'm just excited. I've, I've got some cool stuff. I'm hoping we get to do next year. It'll be a good time. There's stuff other than games, too, I want to do next year, too. Got some projects I've been working on. Could be fun. I keep forgetting to plant the damn flowers here so I can improve the quality of my honey. The slipping Walter. God, the clock is kind of cool though, isn't it? I actually really like how that looks. My farm is immortal now. You have a, te a theme for 2023 yet? I don't. No, I, I don't. Um, but I'm gonna. That's why I'm taking the break as well. I don't. I don't have a, like. I. I don't have one that like I want to share just yet. If that makes sense. I knew going into this year that the theme was just favorite games. Cause like, cause it was basically like a bunch of games that were my favorite and in a lot of cult classics, and like that was very much the plan going into the year. And I would like to think on the other side we've done pretty damn well. We played a lot of good shit this year. There's been very few bad games we played this year, too. But the, 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 like, standouts would be, like, I mean, obviously the metaverse, just for shits and giggles. But, uh, uh, like, the quarry would be one that I would say is kind of bad. Heavy Rain would be one. Ratatouille was a bit shy. <laughs> we just did that one for the novelty more than anything. But, like, most of the games we played have actually been, like, really fucking good games. Really good. Yeah, so the worst games year next. Yeah, like, the worst games ever. It's like, this is terrible. You're not going to enjoy anything this year I play. <laughs> the, uh, the follow-up to the good game year. So everything's shit this year. God, like, oh, why is he playing that game? That's what I want people to say on every single live stream I do. It's like, oh, disappointing. 
Oh, another stinker from the RT game this year. <laughs> we can end the year with the worst of RT game. I love the idea of a worst of RT game, honestly. <laughs> I don't know how we edit that together, Chloe, but like literally like the worst supercut where like, it's just awful. It's all the terrible moments. It's like, oh, I'm having tech difficulties again. <laughs> and it's like a fucking montage. <laughs> you remember all those times my voice cracked? Like, let's, let's uh, get a compilation of that. It's like, oh! Uh, that, that sounds like truly awful. <laughs> it just ends with me playing Fortnite or something and doing like a sick dab. And I, I thank you for watching the worst of our TK. <laughs> ah, ah, it never gets old. Pop that in there. Gotta remember to feed the animals. Toad voice compilation. <laughs> Dan, you can't play Fortnite till you're 36. True. I guess 36 will be the worst of RT game. That's the that's the year you gotta keep an eye out for. <laughs> Just <laughs> like just wait for nine years from now. It's gonna be a real shit one. <laughs> That's how you know it's the channel you want to subscribe to. Most people they promise that you know, like I want to keep improving my content over time. Uh, you know, I wanna I wanna keep putting it the best I possibly can. No, it's like, I promise the opposite. Like it's gonna gradually slide, diminishing quality. There's gonna be like a laugh track on every video. It's gonna be really obnoxious by the four ear. Let me tell you. I'm gonna like like minimize like ha make the game screen like ridiculously small so most of the screen is taken up by just like the Twitch alerts. I'm gonna constantly ask like, hey, if you could smash that Prime button, you know, make sure you click that bell. Click. Hello. Welcome to the sub club. It's gonna be horrendous. That's the year I'm excited for. <laughs> Can't forget the dank sound effects. Yeah, it needs to be like over the top. And we'll end we'll, and we'll end the year with like a Call of Duty clip montage. Like real like 2006 energy. That's how we wrap it up. Full circle. But it's like dubstep music player, like blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Windows Movie Maker intro. Worst of RT game coming soon. Get excited, folks. Get excited. Animals, please stop escaping. You need to stay inside. Uh, I'm gonna go fish on the island a while. Compilation of RT mispronouncing things. Sammy! Willie will let me uh, lug a jet ski out here. Nah. Sebby, join me for a spot of fishing with your old man. Just hang out with him a while. Can the mic quality gradually get worse too? Yeah, instead of like improving as the years go on, it's like we get uh, closer and closer to like an Xbox Live microphone. And like by the end, like it might like the audio quality is basically <laughs> You can just hear me like I'll also have like um, some uh, like you know videos where instead of me talking over gameplay, uh, I'm completely silent, but my mic is distinctly on, so you can still hear me like typing and stuff like that. And you just occasionally hear sounds where it's like, huh, or like me taking a sip of a drink. Where it's like, Pfft. but I'm not saying anything. And sometimes I'll like laugh at what's happening. It's like, <laughs> and don't I just don't say anything.
quality content is coming. Get excited, gang. Oh my fucking lord. Okay, that was probably a good one. Unregistered hypercab too, of course, of course. Only the finest. Uh, Blue, thank you for the 100 bits. Thank you very much. Merry Christmas to you. It's back. Uh, Sandal, thank you for a 1,000 bits earlier. I was to say thank you. I've been sick the past three weeks straight and your content has been so I've been able to relax to while focusing on not dying. Get well soon. Get well soon. Thank you very much. One of my other favorite streams had to do a Superman 64 for a sub goal. So I'd actually be excited if you did a worst of RT game. Oh jeez, that, that, that game seems like torture. I want the chest, but I also want the fish. I didn't get it. RT does shit because one person in chat obnoxiously says he shouldn't compilation. <laughs> hey, that's already quite a few videos, right? Let's be real here. <laughs> I'm pretty sure like a few of the City Skylines ones have like, and the, pre the stupid premise we've had has solely been because someone's saying, no, you can't do that. And I've just like set out to prove them wrong. Like, that's happened quite a few times. I'm so stubborn. <laughs> that one guy who's always wrong compilation. Oh, Jesus. That'd be great. That's why you're maidenless, Dan. <laughs> Jesus. A bit harsh. Yeah, that video would eat shit from Persona. Oh, at that fucking moment, yeah. We beat McDonald's. Like, no maidens, no maidens. Do people still use that insult? I don't think they do. I mean, when Elden Ring came out, that was a thing. What's wrong, maidenless? Why are you still a virgin? <laughs> hey, RT Game! Haven't been by a stream a while. Uh, you know, I'll try to catch you when I can. I love your content at work. What? Wh why are you a virgin? Like, why, why, why would you even say that in a Twitch chat? Like, what does that accomplish? <laughs> what? What's the goal? <laughs> hey, Virginia Virgin is your guy from Cyberpunk. True. They don't say maidenless anymore. They say, you have no he-hoes. <laughs> <laughs> no he hoes. And it's just a picture of like Jack Frost smiling at you. I love it. Uh, sure, I'll take- what, what's going on here? Oh, they're all heading home. Wait, Subby! Subby, we- the day- the day is but young, Subby! Subby, we got a fish! They're just leaving. Well, actually, they're just sitting in the boat and waiting, because the boat- I don't think the boat ever disappears. They're just gonna sit there. They always gotta keep the boat open so that you, you, like, you the player can get home. You should do a modded playthrough? I'm honestly good. I've really loved what I played of Stardew. 
I've loved what I play already. I'm happy to kind of leave it there. You know, we're, we're back for Christmas just because I thought it'd be nice. I guess I'll get some old fishing. Man, take a chill. Dan, when are you playing Mr. Krabs overdoses on ketamine and dies? Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> oh, no, if I should wish you a Merry Christmas, I'll be honest. Uh, <laughs> it's an actual game. Why? Why does that exist? <laughs> How much is chat dr drunk today? They've gone, got a little higher than the old eggnog, you know what I'm saying. Their eggs are pretty nogged. The same guy made Club Penguin Vietnam. What the fuck is Club Penguin Vietnam? I, I don't want to know, do I? I, I, I just don't want to know. Actually, yeah, don't 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 answer that question. No, I don't, I don't want to know. Want to find out? No, I actually don't. I actually don't. Do not explain it to me. I do not wish to know. I want to have a very Merry Christmas. That's all I want to do today. Ah, God. Card Jitsu stream win. I don't know what that is. Are you gay? <laughs> you, are you guys okay today? Is there something you want to tell me about how your Christmas is going? <laughs> We're getting some real fucking weird questions. <laughs> what's going on, chat? What's, what's what's happening? Do you have a loving family? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Very thankful for my family. They're very good to me. Catch another fish. How bad was your childhood? My, my childhood was... I was just fine. I was pretty sheltered as a kid, honestly. Innocent little fella. And then I was introduced to the larger world. Nothing was the same. You watch James Bond. I did watch James Bond, but you have to remember, like, any time, like, anything romantic would happen on screen, I would I would also cover my eyes as a kid, because I couldn't stand it. Like, without, without fail, it's like, ooh, they're kissing again. But I just wanted to see, like, Bond. I, I just like James Bond, because, like, oh my god, he's a cool spy man. Completely oblivious to the copious amounts of alcohol and, um, you know, pretty poor treatment of women across the board. <laughs> no, bon Bond's not a role model, to say the least. <laughs> Good action films, though. <laughs> Uh, Mario, thank you for 100 bits. Hey, Daniel, do you support Hawaiian sovereignty? Or are you in support of the fucker known as Sanford B. Dole? What? I, I, I don't know what you, I don't know if that's a meme. I don't know if you're being genuine. I don't know what's going on there. This is too much for a Twitch chat and a live stream to handle. I'm going to be frank with you. Like, half the time here, we just say PogChamp to each other and, like, say nice when 69 is set on stream. I, uh, that's too complicated a question. That's too complicated. <laughs> I am not informed. I, I'm, I'm, 
I don't know what you mean. <laughs> like, also, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. New racket for the super cucumber. Nice. I actually kind of love the vision. When are we gonna get a hee ho emote? Uh, I, I want to get some new emotes like that. Yeah, I, I have to redo them again because um, I changed a bunch of the emotes before because uh, they when when Twitch added follower emotes, I was like, great, we can like make some more of like the cool emotes like more accessible. And then they flip flopped on the policy for it, where it's like, yeah, but you, you get follower emotes, but you can't use them in anyone else's channel. So we had a bunch of emotes that would then just lock to our own channel. But now they've changed it the other way again. Um, so I, I, I need to take a look again and um, decide what we want. Because we, we do actually have a few extra emote slots now. <laughs> kind of just brought some old ones back. Like the Hive Mind Seagull one has returned. People that might have spotted it. The F-bomb from Minecraft Story Mode is here too. Yeah, it's one of those things, like, um, when I'm off on my break, I'm gonna just take a look at it. I, I definitely want he ho as an emote. I think I just want it to be, like, uh, like, Jack Frost face. I think that's all it needs to be. I think we, I don't think we even make it, the, I don't think we make it Jack Block, Jack Black in particular, just because it'll stand out more as Jack Frost. Personally. Make one about France not existent. That's not a oh the popular stream joke. I'm always on about how France isn't a country. That's not that's not even a joke we have. You've been watching someone else's channel. That's not me. Gotta go home. It's not, uh, that's, that's not a funny meme of the RT brand. That is be a weird dad, I'm scared. Everyone processes Christmas differently, you know? It's okay, we're gonna be all right. We're gonna get there, we'll be okay. God, I love the RT Brad joke that France doesn't exist. Like, oh, that's my favorite one. Like, you remember when he said, Fra like, France? Je n'ai pas. Huh! Like, what? Sorry? Sell a bunch of the fish out. Oh, I want those geos. They're gone. They're gone. 16 lionfish, Jesus. Pop it all in. My favorite bit from RT is when he unhinged his jaw like a snake and swallowed a pigeon whole. <laughs> a true knee slapper. That's, that's. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> It's like, oh, classic! That bird's put up quite a fight! I gotta add my second pair of, of teeth to, like, lock it in place. Like, what? I'm sorry? Oh, Typho, good to see you. Merry Christmas. Why haven't you got VIP? Hang on. Yeah. There we go. It's also alarmingly dark. Give me one second. Hang on. Me slamming the kitchen chair on the ground. <laughs> He's gone. Hey, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you as well. I hope you're keeping warm. Like, Jesus, the cold snap seems rough over there. You're under the rear. 
I hope you're keeping well, though. Oh, Jesus. Fartichoke, thank you for the 5,000 bits. Merry Crisis RT. The best Christmas gift is watching your videos. Thank you for the amazing videos. They always make me laugh. Hope you have an awesome Christmas and a great New Year. Thank you so much. I hope you have a very Merry Christmas yourself. Merry Crisis. Hey, you know, I hope you have a crisis too. Hope you have some kind of calamity happen. Merry Calamity Day. Uh, Taco, thank you for the five gift subs as well. Thank you very much. Even the classic moment when he put a baby in a blender, a true RT moment. Okay, but that one actually happened. All right, let's be real here. I, I did not unhinge my jaw to eat a pigeon, but I did put a child in a blender. Uh, and then proceed to play tennis with said child in the blender. That actually did happen. Yep, that, that one was real. Uh, also, shout out to the Baby in a Blender video game controller. Um, that a, um, nameless entity that no longer wishes to be associated with my content produced for us. Uh, to play Far Cry. That was good fun. That was good fun. <laughs> And it was their idea, not mine, to make that controller. That happened. That also happened. Um, let's spend another day fishing. Is there anything to fish on the pond? No, there's not. There's not any, Not really on the farm. Uh, we can go to the go to the mountains. Rest well, sweet prince. Ah, oh, God. Are you making a joke or- No, I'm not. Uh, look up Dark Souls Baby in a Blender and you'll see the controller in question. We did beat Dark Souls with the Baby in a Blender. Or at least up to Ornstein and Smo. It's like most of the battle, really. You beat it. I beat Ornstein and Smo in Dark Souls with a baby in a blender, yep. Yeah. Oh, I did. That actually happened. This is really painful to use. It's not ergonomic at all. You what? You... You... You should go watch my video on the subject. Oh, you know, sounds like such a zany RT moment there. You should watch my content. And hit that bell to get more moments of that content. You don't want to miss the next time I put a child in a blender. <laughs> what a fucking tagline. <laughs> Who knows what kind of kitchen appliances I might get hold of next. You never know. Just so quirky and zany on this Twitch channel. Remember that time I decked someone with a blueberry muffin? That actually happened. That actually happened. Tom was not happy about it. Watch. There's so many, like, out of context references I can just make. It's great. You remember that time we tortured Jerry in the back alley? <laughs> oh, that sounds really bad without context. Uh, who could forget the bald family, uh, family tree? Tracing the bald family lineage. Remember that time we shot God? Uh, that, that one actually did happen. Yep, no, that happened. Are all of the bald family evil? Oh no, they are now, aren't they? Based on persona logic. Yeah, everyone in the bald family is evil. <laughs> Remember that time he assassinated JFK? <laughs> that one didn't happen. That one didn't happen, despite what people say.
but it did. How many mass murder an entire city all at once? <laughs> That's happened. Uh, you have to be more specific than that. That hardly narrows it down. That hardly narrows it down. Oh, there's a lot of fish in this little spot here. I'm surprised that hasn't gone away yet. Remember the shit volcano? Even like some of the City Skylands classic. Like, huh, you remember that time like RT, uh. Remember that time RT, uh, got an entire city to, uh, gather their shit inside a volcano? And then, uh, the volcano erupted and they all drowned their own shit? Man. What a gamer. That's my streamer. Remember that time, uh, he gave, uh, RT gave, uh, Jim Carrey free will and he became sentient? And longed for debt and did nothing with his time on this planet? What a gamer. Oh, God. IT, you are so normal. He's so relatable, you know? Like, oh, no way, I drowned my own city in their own shit, too. It's so relatable. Get a hashtag going. He's just like me, for real. <laughs> uh, it's your boy. Thank you for the 300 bits. Let me just catch this fish real quick. Hang on. I've uh, been sick for the past week. I'm going to spend a lot of my time uh, while dying in bed watching through your drug exploits in Stardew and your Mario Sunshine playthrough. Thanks for giving me something to do while I get over this cold. Uh, get well soon. A very Merry Christmas to you. Hope you're feeling okay. At NATO. <laughs> As the official NATO Twitch channel. I don't think that's a thing. I don't think that's a thing. I mean, it might be before long. Like, fucking the European Union tried to host a metaverse party. Like, four people showed up. It could be. I th Bernie Sanders has a Twitch, doesn't he? I'm pretty sure Bernie does. He had one. He, he used it for, like, some of his campaigns before, which is just kind of... Like, I mean, it's, it's just kind of funny if you think about it, you know? Cause like, it's fucking Twitch, it's like video games and that. Like, half oh, Bernie Sanders. I gave him my Twitch Prime. <laughs> just, it just sounds a bit weird. <laughs> it doesn't matter who you swap it with. AOC does- yeah, AOC played like, um, fucking Among Us with some people, didn't she? <laughs> that was wild. I remember that. I think Sean was in that. Uh. Maybe we'll get to the day where Bernie streams again, you know, like, um, outside of politics. Like, maybe Bernie's just playing, like, Fortnite. And we can, like, send Bernie Sanders a, a raid from our Twitch channel. Like, Bianco bros, meet the Bernie bros. Uh, the UK government has a Twitch as emotes and everything. Then it got rid of chat so nobody could ch chat. Oh, I, I think I remember seeing part of that streamed. It was like Parliament streams or something. I think everyone was just saying your mic is muted. <laughs> People were just like fucking with them in chat. Oh no, no, I, I know what it was. I know what it was. <laughs> oh, this is terrible. Uh, they were saying Mike mute it because they had like a sign language interpreter at the side. Um, for the parliament conference. 
So there was just a bunch of people in chat. It was like, bro, bro, we can't hear you. <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> His Twitch chat, Twitch chat reacts to like, you know, UK politics. I'm just messing with the stream. Oh uh, God! How oh, we got a sturgeon? Pro Snoop Dogg would be fun to play stuff with. The Snoop Dogg stream? I, I have no idea. I have no idea. I'm trying to think of like the most out of place like Irish person I can think of that would be like potentially on Twitch. I really can't think of any. I can't think of any. I don't think we have any politicians who know what Twitch is in this country. <laughs> or like let alone YouTube. It's like a mystery thumb. That's why we need game we need a gamer president in Ireland, you know? Mickey D is gonna be out soon. I could do it. Finally have a gamer in office. Time to fight. Hang on. I would not be able to be president of Ireland. You have to actually have a uh, fluent Irish <laughs> as part of it, as you might expect. It's a different kind of president in Ireland, too. It's like a culture ambassador. We have, like, a prime minister, too, who's, like, the real kind of position of power. All that for Cole. That Cole put up a fight, yeah. Please don't flood us and poop. I could just launch, like, a meme political campaign. <laughs> it's like, you know, I'm already so- I describe myself as somewhat of a people person. Cut to, like, the- the poop Kano just overflowing. And, like, drowning out the city. campaign just based on taking the spire down. That's like my only policy. <laughs> it's like, so what So what do you want to do if you get in office? Like, imagine, like, as a politician, that's the only campaign difference you want to make. Like, how do you feel about the environment? Like, no, I don't care about that. The big polls gotta go. <laughs> What's your plan for taxes? Well, we're gonna be able to make a killing if, just by getting rid of the pole, you know? We'll save some money there. It's like, obsessed. <laughs> you get a hundred percent of the votes. Like, my only campaign. It's like, right, see you all in four years then, for the next election. I'll find another big pole then to take down. Put a stand up against Polish people. No, let's not misconstrue this. I am talking about the spire. It is a monument in Dublin and it's a big pole. I am not talking about Polish people. Because <laughs> that is, sounds terrible. It's like, Jesus, he's just terrible today. I don't know if he should have a Merry Christmas. <laughs> didn't know he hated the Polish so much. No, let's not misconstrue this. I'm talking about the Spire. <laughs> Irishman hates Poland. No. RT calls Jesus terrible on Christmas. <laughs> oh, Christmas is old fashioned. Like, you know, Jesus, he's been dead like 2,000 years. We should call it Santimus. You know, because he's the main character of Christmas. He's what the brands associate with. You know, Coca-Cola, they don't have Jesus Christ on the cross with a bottle of Coke in his hand saying, you know, that, that's refreshing in this moment of agony. No, it's Father Christmas. We need a different image.
Hey, we get Colonel Sanders involved, you know, he's already like occupied Christmas uh, in Asian territories, apparently. <laughs> he has, it's tradition now. You get KFC at Christmas. It's a completely marketing campaign, but it, the association's just there. That's what you do. My friend in Japan, he's getting KFC today. That's, that's what you do. Does Colonel Sanders also have a Twitch channel? There, there is like a KFC gaming channel. <laughs> I got asked um, for a sponsor once with KFC gaming. <laughs> they wanted to send, it was like, do you know that console where it was like the chicken fryer, but it's also a PC? <laughs> they asked me to receive one. I was just like, I don't fucking need this. <laughs> I don't need it. Like, no, no it's real. They, they apparently made a limited number of them, I think. It was something weird like that. You should have gotten it. I don't want to be like, hey, I got sponsored by KFC today, like, for no fucking reason. Like, it doesn't make sense for me. That's not how I do sponsors. Just sell it on eBay. Should have got it just to collect its value. You have a baby in a blender, but you said no to a deep fryer console. <laughs> Look, I have enough weird kitchen appliances as is, right? There's a Wendy's channel too. Yeah, w Wendy's is apparently huge on Twitch now. I think Chuck E. Cheese has a channel too. Like, there's a lot of weird brands that you wouldn't expect that are just on Twitch these days. I think like Chuck E. Cheese gaming is the thing. <laughs> Sounds really weird to say aloud. There is a KFC video game too. The Dayton Sim. Oh god. Oh shit, I finally got this. Oh, I forgot I didn't have max stats and everything. Uh, fish work more. That, 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 that seems good. Money. I don't know that took effect immediately there. It was something in the box. Should collab with a fast food brand. But like, what, what am I gonna do? I've technically been sponsored by Red Bull, but that's because they do a lot of, like, esports and sports tournaments in general. They sponsored the City Skylines one. I've been sponsored by them, but, like, like what am I- Like, what is it gonna bring to the channel that's, like, you know, like, at the start of every video, I'm like, and you know, this video is brought to you by, like, McDonald's! <laughs> what, what does that add to my content? Papa John's could sponsor you and you could order pizza again. <laughs> oh no, I missed a few of Wait, though the Junimos missed some of these. Junimo friends, what's going on? Could have finally fed us with the KF console. <laughs> Oh god. No, I, I mean, I, I turned it down just because I, I didn't see the point in like being sponsored by KFC for this, you know? Like, because I'm, 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 I'm picking what my sponsors. It tends to be like, is it a, a game that like, I'm genuinely interested in? It tends to be how I go. I'm very picky. But that's because I never want to, you know, I, I don't want my content to just be like a massive like just plug every single video and shit like that you know I want it to be stuff that I'm just genuinely interested in or I genuinely had a good time with the father the fried chicken who cares about personal integrity <laughs> 
No, this stream is actually brought to you by seven different sponsors. If the plug is a meme, it could still be funny. I mean, we had we've had some funny ones still. I think I think that the power wash sim guys were so, uh, they, I, they they were so on board for everything. I still remember like like um when I, when we were doing that stream, basically we had the power wash IRL. Uh, we had like real equipment that could just be clean a mock alley, but the rep for for power washing a uh, sim. That I, I want to describe them as a bit bloodthirsty because. Like, after everything I was doing to Jerry, I would talk to him during the break, and they were like, Can you smash Jerry's head in with the guitar? <laughs> and even I was like, that actually seems a bit dangerous. But they really wanted me to do that. They really wanted me to just hurt that mannequin more. <laughs> and like, I had to, like, take a step back. It's like, I don't know if I'm, like, physically strong enough to do this. Like, could you hurt him? Like, basically, yeah. No, I mean, th 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 they're a lovely gang. They're a lovely bunch. Apparently, Jerry's still become has become somewhat of an icon since that stream. He's still posted about every now and then on, like, the Power Wash Twitter. Which, is honestly, like, warms my heart. Jerry's still making the rounds. Oh, God. Uh, it's rain in chat. Is there anywhere we want to fish for, like, a super fish? Is there anywhere I should be looking at summer? Where are we- where are we going? On the beach? Go study. That's not helpful. The beach on the east dock. Okay, hang on. Let me take my fancy teleportation system. Oh, they're off to the island. So, on, on the side over here, is it? What was your favorite series this year? I personally am going to give it to Persona. Uh, I've hugely enjoyed that. Oh, hey, it's yourself. Got the amulet worked out for you, lad. Oh, yeah, you have to get the thing to get married from him or something. Uh, but I would give it to Persona, though, like, just in terms of, like, the amount of hours and just how entertaining that game is in general. It's got, like, like a lot of anime bollocks literature at it, but it's still wildly entertaining, and I really enjoyed it. Stardew would be, would be a close second. And, like, Elden Ring is up there, too. Bloodborne's up there. Kirby's up there. Oh my god. Okay, I think that was the super fish. That caught me a bit off guard. He just fucking zoomed. Super fish has a sombrero. What? Okay. I teach you play Oblivion, that would be funny as fuck. I've played Oblivion. This, if you search RT Game Oblivion, you'll get like three videos. We did that. Way back in the day. Give it, give it, the, give it an old Google. What, really? Yeah, no, I've played Oblivion. We had like Mike Myers, but he looked like a bit like um, Phineas from Phineas and Ferb for some reason. <laughs> Bit oblivion. Something to watch next then. Yeah, go enjoy it. You have big any big plans for 2023 you can already share. I've got nothing that's ready to share. I've got nothing that's ready to share just yet. Uh that's mainly for my own kind of mental well being. I wait until I'm ready. Because otherwise it puts a lot of pressure on me. I don't want to, like, promise you guys the world and have, like, a repeat of, like, the Spoon Awards or some shit. Where it's, like, I vastly underestimate the amount of work. That was a special one. He's gone. Where I vastly underestimate, like, uh, the amount of work required. And I, I just can't do it. You know, so I, I that's why, I, like, when, I'm, when it's ready, it's ready and you'll see it. But what I can say is I have some fun stuff coming. 
Some really different stuff, too. Are you opening a fast food chain next year? <laughs> yeah, get, get your air tacos. RT Burger. It's like McDonald's, but more expensive. <laughs> that'll, that'll be my brand. <laughs> the shitty brand. It's literally the same, but additional price. McDonald's restaurant coming soon. Are you selling the brick as merch like the Supreme Brick? Uh, no, no, we're not. <laughs> I don't think people want me to make an actual brick as merch. I think that would just be kind of stupid. Also, you could pay a ton in postage because it's quite heavy. Plushy of a brick. I mean, that's quite- that's kind of cute. I like the idea of a plush brick. Cause then you can chuck it at someone and they will not murder them. That might be cuter. Signed brick auction for charity. I mean, we just buy like a bag of bricks and just get a sharpie. The new product line is here. <laughs> no sombrero fish again. He, he was a speedy fucker when he comes up. You remember when RT sold his bat water for charity? That one only kind of happened, right? We did give bat water to the highest donation on that charity stream. We did. But, as a joke, we just signed their name on the bat water. Sombrero fish, no! Oh, he's too fucking speedy. He's too speedy, I, I can't get him. I can't get him. Try a bit longer. How about a Met Plushes merch too? I... Oh my god, you... Mm. Everyone shut up! Someone said something. Who was that? Who was that? It was me, ban that person. You got. You got. I'll see you in 2024. You do not get to watch the next year of content now. Ah, Jesus. Okay, let's return home. Uh, gang. I am gonna have to wrap up the stream there. Uh, cause I have to hop on my end. But it has been wonderful streaming on Christmas for you. And I hope you've all enjoyed it. Wait, wait, wait! Actually, before I do that, God, I forgot to do the one fucking thing I promised. Hang on. <laughs> let me let me go to bed. I'm gonna let you guys see the intro for the best of. It doesn't release until six tonight. You guys get to see it an hour early. Okay. Hang on. Let me let me gear this on up for you. 
I almost forgot. That was close. <laughs> almost got it wrong. Okay, I'm trying I'm trying to just line it up. Okay, professional streamer. I'm hoping this works. Here it is. Okay, you got it's three hours long. I was not kidding. I was not kidding. But let me let me show you guys the intro, okay? Broskies, it's your man. Wait. What's up my broskies? It's your man, little man. <laughs> that would always get me. Oh, Jesus! I'm so sorry. Trust me. <laughs> oh, my God. Why? <laughs> what have you done? Thought you the fuck? God, well. Fuck! <laughs> oh no. You didn't touch! It was scripted. Spoilers oh, for like no, every game. Okay. There's no, a lot like... of them here. Granddad. <laughs> okay, Pond. What's the plan here? Eat your pie! Eat your no, pie! Bunger? <laughs> Show me the money. I found you. Here it comes. Did you say something, Cheech? <gasps> I did it! You're gonna be okay, Jerry! <laughs> I'm Johnny Anime. I've turned myself into a blueberry semi. You really lit a fire in my heart and my asshole. You're out of the guild final. What the fuck? Who needs gym badges? No. Take that, Napoleon! I, I never want to play that again. Give us some Doom sound. Never. Is it worth it? You can do it, Kirby! <laughs> oh no, <laughs> We have pants! Oh, yes. oh no! Oh, it's better this way. And pause the game. <laughs> No! Candy, why? Oh my god! Rot in hell! This is the most gamer thing I've ever done there. Gosh, no! Sammy, why are you crying? I'm an orc. <laughs> that is just a naked man. Do you feel connected to that man's ass? Ask the intro to the best of. <laughs> uh, now you got the remaining like three hours of the video to enjoy. Uh, that will be releasing in about an hour. Uh, so I hope people enjoy it. Let me let me just stick on some music just for a minute. Hang on. Well, I mean, we'll go. We already know what we're playing here. Uh, everyone here, thank you so much for all the support in 2022. I hope you've all enjoyed the year of content it has been. Thank you as ever for supporting me through it all. Um, it's been a hell of a year. We did a lot, like, a, just a lot of stuff I always wanted to do this year. Uh, and it, it just really means the world. Uh, of course, everyone here, please give it up for Chloe, who has done a phenomenal job. Uh, continually just editing everything. We literally wouldn't be, be able to put out as many series as we did without her edits. So p thank you so much, Chloe. Uh, uh, to all the artists in the community that have been involved, like kind of emotes, 
uh, uh, like thumbnails and just various projects through the year as well. All my friends who have kind of support the content too and even like actively taking part like Spiff, Kiwo, Kevin, the lads, Kelly. So many to name. Cake Jumper. And just all of you for just being a good bunch. And, you know, just supporting me, enjoying it. Always being there. Like, it really means a lot. Uh, I'm officially on break. So, I will be streaming again in two weeks' time. We're gonna, I'm going to come out of my break to play a little bit of Persona. But then I'm going back into break. Um, we'll be returning to regular streams and regular content come, like, later January. Is the plan. Um, if you want content to watch, there is plenty of it on the YouTube channel. This will be the only video up there for a while. All of the playlists are organized. You can go watch them all. They're all there on the channel homepage. Like, like every series we did this year is laid out. You can go give it a watch if you want something more. So you're not left empty handed. The fridge is stocked. Can't wait to get right back to it, but also get a well-deserved break in. Thanks, Chloe. No, likewise. Likewise to yourself. Yeah, it's, it's been it's been a crazy year. I, I'm I'm excited for next year too. Um, I've got I've got stuff that I'm working on. I just excited to release it. It's gonna be a bit different. <laughs> some of it. Like, I don't want to say too much. I've just got I've got some stuff I'm working on though. Uh, I think it'll be fun. I think it'll be very fun. Gonna miss you. I'll miss all of you. I will. I will. I always feel it when I take time away. It's like I have to be like wrestled away from my computer and just like streaming in general to like actually take time off. It's important I do though. It's important I do because burnout is a very real thing in this industry and this field. You know, you gotta take time away to kind of relax, recharge a bit, come back with renewed energy. I do love it though. I will miss this. Hey, you know, it's it, two weeks. I'll be talking to you though. I'll be able to chip in like mid break. We're gonna do a cheeky bit of persona. So you know, it won't be too long until I see us. Won't be too long. Have a very Merry Christmas as well, everyone. Very Merry Christmas. Again, the full video of that is gonna be releasing in an hour. So you can you can go watch it soon. Uh, in the meanwhile. Let me see who is streaming. Ah, uh, the... It's just Kiwo. It's just Kiwo. Go say hey to Kiwo. <laughs> Literally no one else I know. Please go wish Kiwo a very Merry Christmas. She is a wonderful friend. Just playing some projects on, boy. Go say hey. Happy holidays, everyone. I'll see you all in the new year. Be good to each other. Take care.